Ooh, what is it, Clever Coop family? Oh no, the hats are still on the pigeons. As, as they say um hi everybody happy wednesday to you oh how fun a good old stream on a not normal stream day uh thanks so much for joining me on an off schedule day um like i said in general i was going to be adding more stream times and such but this week has gotten so busy and i've had some cool opportunities that i couldn't pass up um so normal stream times this week are like not a thing um new spooky beanie yeah you know what's funny is i was wearing a different spooky beanie today why is that why is that it's like phasing through like it's green screen but it's so very orange I need to white balance this camera anyway um i uh first of all it was my friend austin's birthday last night um and the whole day but celebrated last night um and i got to go to a place in la called the magic castle which i've never been to before um it was really cool i'll tell you all about that in a minute and then tomorrow i'm actually taking a class i'm taking a voiceover workshop um because I need to and I need to you know I've just been sort of like making it through before as opposed to like learning and continuing to grow and so this year I'm not waiting till 2024 but like this coming year I really want to make an effort to like learn like really learn um so that's that's what I'm doing uh ooh fun I've never been to the magic castle any of my trips here what's up cypher y'all we have another streamer very talented and skilled I say skill because like we work hard right cypher we're not just born with all of this streaming um cypher is in the chat y'all show cypher some love um thanks for being here uh yeah it was my first time i've been in la like 13 14 years and it's like an la staple but you like have to sort of know someone who works there and i do but i like have never it's, it's the kind of thing where like you know the person but you haven't hung out enough and you don't want to be like hi the one time i need one time i hit you up i need something like no one wants to be that person so Funnily enough, I ran into them uh, while I was there and they're like, why didn't you hit me up? I'm like, uh, I never, I have a hard time believing people are my friends. Any hoozle. Um, it's so good to see y'all. Uh, so anyway, tomorrow I'm doing that voiceover class um, during when I would normally stream. So yada, yada, yada. Um, so tonight, so here I am. Um, Any hoozle. Uh, let's see here. Welcome. The giant pigeon is battle pigeon. Yes. Uh, Lumber Max must have asked about the pigeon. This is battle pigeon. Uh, she is our matriarch, our confessor our friend our guy our guide our confidant our patron saint of being clever um it's uh it's yeah it's just a big old pigeon <laughs> um but it's wonderful to see y'all thanks for joining me on an off night um won't be the longest stream in the world but i really wanted to stream and say hi and check in um so how y'all doing you're just about to leave work k check oh good get out of there turn turn unless you are the boss which is very possible turn to your boss hold up your phone show them show them twitch and just be like come on and they'll be like you know what heck oh heck it's nine minutes till the hour get out of here kid have some fun um we do have a few sub bomb oh wait hold up we got to focus on jayla rock for a minute done with finals congratulations to you finals i do not miss finals i do not miss finals school tests one type of intelligence and like unless you're that type it's just torture um i've never understood that but goodness gracious um all right uh damn it darcy gifting us up to marino diaz 96 thank you very much damn it darcy welcome back marino diaz we've also got a uh, big ticks um 69.96 nice yes nice. um uh gifting to the emily moriarty welcome back emily moriarty and thank you big Tex. And then we've got Blue Husky 2001. Thank you very much, Blue Husky. Drop in five flipping gift subs. Our first big old gift sub bomb of the stream. Uh, gifting to Gia, Rach11, and MU, uh, Nana1411, Hi Bits, and then I'm Kate. How do we know if that's true, Kate? I'm just gonna have to trust you. Just when I learned how to trust again. Um, all right. Uh, how is your voice after that TikTok? So Sleepy Little Rider, I'm, I'm surprised a lot of people didn't notice this. I, uh, my second most recent TikTok, because I just posted a sponsored one uh, by Alienware. Shout out to Alienware. Love working with Alienware. Please go show that some love if you feel like it. TikTok and Instagram. Um, but the one before that, that was just a sound. That was someone, that was another creator that made that noise. And then I just used that sound and, and lip synced to it. Um, so my voice is fine. I didn't make it, I didn't make a damn peep. Um, uh, thank you all so much though. Okay, but the Alienware TikTok is pure perfection. I appreciate that, Rosa Elena. That is the one that I stayed up till 6 a.m. doing. So I'm glad people liked it. Um, it's I just love working with Alienware, not only because the products are incredible, but um 
they give me a lot of like creative freedom where I'm like, hey, I think this would be funny and I think it works for what you're trying to do. And they're just like, do it. I'm like, great. Um, it was insane in the best way possible. Good. That's what I like because I'm kind of unhinged in the best way possible. Um, obsessed with the cat sweater. Yeah, I spent a long time on the old internets tracking down the proper sweater. Um, and I loved it. Uh, I still have it. It's it's wearable. It's not of a poor quality. It's it's definitely like I ordered online quickly quality, but it's like I think it can stand a few washes. I think I can wear it a bit. Um, we got Demo Nacho dropping three flipping gift subs. Thank you very much, Demo Nacho. Appreciate you. Gifting to Kipper the Kitten, the Big Wizard Mike, and then Raging Wench. Thank you so much. Those are all new peeps. Welcome on in. No, not fast fashion, uh, Barbie, but high, but still, but like, not like handmade by a lady who's been making sweaters for a hundred years like it's you know i don't i think it's hard to get away fully from some kind of oh oh what's up well, wait twitch added 50 bits to a different tier that's interesting thank you actual twitch for popping in chat weird cool like it um but yeah it's it, even even clothes you get at a place where you're like this is probably fine it's probably like fine as opposed to like oh good you know so anyway um demo Nostra, thank you for that sub bomb we got damn it darcy dropping two flipping gift subs no i'm not mad at darcy that's their name gifting to dubba jake and then obsessive compulse i love that name for many reasons uh, oh there's bonus bits until december 20th okay all right well, thank you for letting me know, Wayward Jaybird. I had no idea. Um, uh, all right. I love these Switch names. Me too, Owly Bird. Me too, indeed. Um, hey, we made it to a hype train level three. I appreciate y'all. Thank you so much. We also got a uh, Juicebox Mommy 69. Uh, nice. Gifting to Shibuya Dust because uh, there was a lot of construction on the Shibuya train station for a long time, right? No, that was Shinjuku. Whatever. Um, Juice box mommy. Thank you very much. I appreciate you. Thank you for the 500 bits servo. That's very nice. And then they added 50 bits to that and then another 25 unlocked. I don't know what any of that means. I didn't look up the how that's done, but thank you, Twitch, and thank you, servo. <laughs> um I was disappointed when I thought it was Thursday earlier, but now stream says the crafty tarfith. Yeah, I don't know where in the world you are, so it might be Thursday for you, but it's not for me. And usually it would be for me, but it's not. Um, and then we got a Mandy M. Davis drop in. Six, 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 sub, sub, sub. Thank you very much, Mandy M. Davis. Gifting to Ram Bam, Cactus Alice, uh, Alchemist Fire 613, Fiery Death, uh, excuse me, uh, no, Mary Death. Sorry, I combined that with the one previous. V squared 30 and then MV gimmick. Thank you so very much. I appreciate you um y'all i'm excited to hang out tonight hey if you are new because i did see we had a lot of uh, first time chatters because this is a wednesday and i don't usually stream now um my name is damien i'm a voice actor i'm a twitch streamer you may also know me from the youtube channel smosh um so yeah that's me i stream tuesday thursday sunday i'm gonna be putting a little more emphasis on streaming in the new year i'm still figuring out what that looks like um but yeah, come follow along if you feel like it. And if not, well, then thanks for stopping by and at least saying hi for a minute. Um, all right. Alice, thank you for the 100 bits. Appreciate that. I got to go home and finish some finals. This week has been hectic. Yeah, for anybody there who's who's dealing with finals and or if you work a service job and it's right before the holidays, bless your bones. Um, good luck to you. Um, stay strong. You got this. You got this. Maple Sugar Crystal says, thank you for the My Happy Marriage interview. It felt like you guys were just having a private chill conversation. Thank you, Maple Sugar Crystal. That's also a delightful name. Um, Yeah, uh, y'all, I sat down again with Chris Mayek. I don't know if I'm saying that name properly. I hope I am. Um, Maybe it's Mayek, and then you are Maple Sugar Crystal. I don't know. Um, But uh, we'll we'll post the link in a, in a little bit to their YouTube channel. Um, I haven't posted on Twitter yet because Twitter is a, a dumpster fire. Um, but yeah, it was a lovely, like, one-hour interview. It was really cool. Um, as a newbie, I feel very welcome. Well, Luis, that's exactly what we want. Maybe it's Luisa? Yeah, it's probably Luisa Lopez MX. There we go. Luisa. Probably, I think. Uh, we're gonna get a grocery store is rough right now. God, I can't imagine Rachel the Llama Corn. I feel like that's a tough job in general. And then on the holidays, it's just bonkers town express. Hey, what's up, Violet? Y'all, that's my friend Violet. Uh, she's also a very lovely streamer. 
um please go show violet some love as well what's up with the pigeons in back no judgment just curious um lily lightly i like pigeons like i just think they're funny um and when i finally got a green screen one day i was like oh i don't have a background i will use this meme of a pigeon that i liked and uh then it's not i didn't uh, change it um oh what's up oh my friend austin is here too austin is also a lovely streamer let's please shout out austin it was also austin's birthday yesterday and then my friend joey is here what's up joey joey is not a streamer but he is probably i think yep my longest friend he's 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 i i should say tall no um we met in like second grade wild um good to see y'all thanks for stopping by well then we're gonna play some video games here pretty soon like i said it won't be the longest stream i have to prep for that voiceover class that i'm taking tomorrow i also have a voiceover booking tomorrow how fun how exciting it's exactly what i wanted to do um yeah, so um yeah but but we're gonna play a little bit um we got kinosaurus rex dropping some bits thank you very much and kalabinari dropping two flipping gift subs thank you for gifting to secluded riot and then taylor gator appreciate you for doing that thank you kalabinari um you still have second grade friends jelly says orion core yes but joey is kind of like an exception sorry i, I, I was about to apologize like my necklace was still in my shirt not sorry it just is there um uh yeah no i don't really have any friends from school back in the day except for joey damien you missed someone flipping a table last night Ooh, fun oh that's right we were going to talk about the magic castle um well shoot that could have been me was there a was there a brawl was there a a wrestling was it wrestling it was insane i feel like y'all decided to come up with a crazy story and just say like oh my god i can't believe you left early to do things we just have to make him feel crazy <laughs> um in Calabinari, thank you again very much i oh, got 100 bits from exo harley d thank you very much um they said they are drawing me and keep an eye out for tags i will do that thank you so much i appreciate that there's video evidence okay i've heard about this artificial intelligence before um we got blue husky with another 200 bits thank you so much trying to survive a headache please take care of yourself i hate headaches who likes them but still um water tylenol whatever you got to do take care of yourself um and then jayla rock with 100 bits thank you so much i appreciate you okay so for anyone who's new here you may have noticed i i'm reading out sub bombs and things like that i also read out new subscribers i read out resubscribers all at the end of the stream and i read out tips with messages attached that being said while those are appreciated and i will always say thank you and it's very nice and helps support me you don't have to do that you can also just hang out here for free and i talk to the chat as well um especially if you're a youngin if you're still like high school age or lowered please hold on to your money if times are tough please hold on to your money i will always be grateful when people support me in that way but i also don't want you to ever i don't ever want to like incentivize it if that makes sense um so take care of yourself first is all i'm saying um so thank you very much and speaking of which we got a few new subscribers everybody please give a spicy clever coop welcome to raiden slayer 21 the gaming hider 04 and then dead chef 15 thank you welcome y'all you now have access to the discord um in addition to emotes and such um we're gonna try to make the discord even better in the new year but welcome on in what's your hat looks cool I'll tell you what it is writing is hard it's too small which i didn't realize until i put it on here but uh it's jack skeleton from the disney christmas movie and i don't know why the orange is like tripping out as though it were green screened i do need to white balance this camera that's for sure it's jack skeleton from the from the movie from the film and he's like, look at this. I'm a steal Christmas and this guy. Um, kidnapping, they call it. Kidnapping. Um, is it too small? Are you a bad or are you a battle, Damien? It could be both, Edgewood Cree. Good to see you, Edgewood Cree. All right, y'all. Okay, so yeah, Magic Castle. I got to go last night because it was Austin's birthday. It was uh, Violet, Austin, and I. Um, it was a lovely time. Um, I had never been. So for anyone who's not familiar, the Magic Castle is a place in LA that is this old mansion that looks kind of like a castle and um it's a very like it's the kind of place where it's like you you have to know someone to get in but it's not like a club it's not like a cool la club or whatever it's just like a bunch of magicians it's a club says okay well then it's a club it's a club but it's not like a club it's like join our club kind of club and it's just a bunch of magicians but not in a clubbing way you know what i'm saying god i hope you know what i'm saying um 
I'm gonna keep reading the chat, but I'm like, I don't think I can corroborate with the chat back and forth due to the time difference. I'm like, my brain is just gonna explode. Um, but yeah, so you have to know someone. Austin knew someone. It was Austin's birthday. Um, and I got to go. And there's just like a bunch of different stages all at once, um, all doing their different shows. And so you get to see, I, we got to see like three, four little attractions and it was a, a grand old time. Um, you have to dress up all fancy though. That is the one thing you got to make sure like if it, you got to go suit and tie or like proper evening wear dress, like it was, it was lovely. Um, so yeah, it was, it was very, very, very fun. Um, Brett and Link told us about this place in their podcast. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, so yeah, that was, it was, it was fun. And like I said, I, I have a friend who does do stuff there. She sings a lot and I think she's been assistant before. Happy Heather. Yes, I'll post a, I'll post a picture tomorrow for sure. Um, yeah, so it was, uh, it was fun. It was a grand old time. Um, I think by the end of the night, I get a little sleepy and like nonverbal and I had to go home to do a bunch of voiceover auditions, which I did get done this morning as well. Um, but yeah, it was, it was great. It was great, great, great. Um, all righty. So let's get ready to uh, play some game. Uh, we do have another uh, new subscriber. Everybody, please give a spicy clever coop welcome to FFS Facey. Thank you so much for doing that and using your prime on me. Appreciate you, oodles of much. All righty. Let's go ahead and get going in the game here. Now, before I do, there is something that is a bit of a tradition in this here stream. Um, you got games on your phone? I do. R107. I do have games on my phone. But I'm not going to tell you which. You have to guess. And it's not. It's not Among Us. All right. Um, I ask a question of the day before we hop into the game, which today will be Baldur's Gate 3. Um, we are midway through Act 3. And while we are also a no spoilers, please, uh, that is a, like, a hard and fast rule for this community. If you are also playing and you are not midway through Act 3, this, as much as I want you to be here, this might be the time to dip out because I don't want you to spoil anything for yourself. Um, we got 100 bits from Diamond. Thank you, Diamond. Thank you, Diamond. Shine bright like a diamond. All right, so question of the day. Oh, that's why you were asking. You're like, question of the day is do you have games on your phone? Um, question of the day is... Who do we have in the chat today? We got Kerosene Entertainment, Drew Me This Way. We got Sammy Antha. We got uh, Madame Darcy, uh, excuse me, Madame uh, Satsi. We got uh, Real Synonymous, Giuseppe, Demonacho, Tiarna, Desi Lu, uh, Max Aroni, uh, Kenna in the Kingdom. We got Good Gaffa, Black Medusa, Chris Sammons, Emily from Cali, Isley Moon, I Am Radical, Toe for 13. We got Winnie the Pooh, uh, Devoid of Stars, Royale. We got Alex Ruth. What's up to Katie Lady, 420 Blaze, Mike, Avalin, uh, Madeline Ebersole. What's up to Shibuki Alarm Pants, Karolinski, I'm Just Joe, uh, Rika Slayer, Ashley of Terry Styles, Some Girl Fish, Gabby Fane, Rosa Elena, Mooing Cat. Geeky on the inside, Botnar. Uh, we got Munoz uh, 33. We got Elia 381. What's up to Max Aroni? Bells Love, Sleepy Little Rider, K Chick, Suthicon, um, Legalis Spoon, Morgan Anderson. What's up to Hootie Ludi Patootie, Royal Binch, um, Beatrives, uh, Lay, Flower Bug, Gabby Fane, JO is here, December Full, Skylar Babes, Little Brat 669, Wake Up. Maggie May, Resplendent, Reveries, Emerald Cricket. What's up to Arachnus Web, uh, Writing is Hard, Basement Mermaid, The Emily Moriarty, uh, Clary Leo, Pandemic Barbie, uh, Maggie Serafina, Happy Heather, and Yanni. Too many to count. That's right, y'all. There are too many people here for science to count. They don't have that many numbers. Um, but tell you what, if I didn't say hi to you right off the bat, I'm sure I'll say hi to you at some point during the stream. Um, so hang out and lurk, hang out and chat, hang out and use me as the background noise while you do the thing you promised you would do a week ago. All that I ask is that you just peep those rules if you're gonna chat, um, because we love our mods and our mods volunteer their time and they don't have to be here and they're here anyway. And we wanna make their job just a little bit easier. So, um, thank you. Thank you for that. Appreciate you. All right, y'all, let's hop into video game. Also, hey, welcome to our new subscribers. Everybody, please give a spicy welcome to uh, Janat and then Enyani or Enyani. Um, thank you very much. Appreciate you. You know what, J uh, Janat? I didn't get your name until I read it out as it's spelled. And now I'm like, is it Janet? But you're saying like, Janat, we gotta go. We have to go, Janat. Any whistle. All righty. Let me load up this here. Video game. Baldur's Gate 3. And if you're not familiar with the game, but you don't care about spoilers, we're going to get you caught up real quick. We're going to get you caught up all lickety split. All right. 
And I'm also going to very gently bring down this music. Here I go. I'm going to do it right this time. I'm going to do it right this time. Here I go. Nope. Shoot. It's going to slam. Here comes the slam. There we go. Yep. <sighs> Why is it always difficult? All right. Cool. Nice. Is it blasphemous to fall asleep to stream? I don't think so, J -Lo Rock. I'll probably have little moments of getting loud, so sorry if you wake up, but like... I guess also that's entirely out of my hands. But um, yeah, no, you can absolutely leave the stream on and have the analytics be like, wow, people really stayed for his whole stream. Meanwhile, you're just... Yeah. All right. Okay. It's soothing, says Shay Sexual. I... And you know what? I'll take it. That's okay. I will take that. I will take that. I recently got VG3 on PS5, but I'm anxious to play. You're anxious to play? Why so anxious, Barbie? It's okay to get it wrong. It's okay to lose the game sometimes. Or our game's just spooky. How's the audio, y'all? Because I know I had to switch it around for Jackbox a little bit. I wonder if F10 would give a clean version of that load screen you could use as your own background slash screen save. It's not a bad idea. I mean, probably. Oh. Yeah, not a bad idea. What's the... There we go. Now now we got screenshot button. There we go. Screenshot... Cypher. That's smart. Yeah, I got three just in case they all, the other two get deleted. Oh, I know it does for here. Oh, got it. For the streamable background. No. <laughs> so here's the thing, Cypher. Here's the... Here's the... See, oh, with the key art. Got it. Maybe. I thought you were first talking about the transition. I was like, so there is absolutely a way I could do that cleanly. I'm just, um, a little lazy. <laughs> so, any hoozle. Um, but thank you. That is a good idea. I'd love to check that out because that is a beautiful looking, that is a beautiful looking. Uh, can you have multiple game files on the same game on PS5? Um, yes. I do believe you can, ePage. However, you can't split a save into two. So for like example, we've been playing on this, um, this save file for so long that when I wanted to play on my own, I was like, I don't want to start from where I'm at and then just do my own thing. Um, and you can't do that without some really crazy workarounds. You would have to start like a new character. New character. Um, is this the first campaign campaign you're playing? Yes, it is, Vonderheide. It is indeed. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and hit continue. So here's basically how I would explain this game to you if you've never seen it before in your life. Do you know D&D? &D? No. Do you have a very rough idea in your brain of D&D &D where you're like, I think there's dice and probably a wizard? Yeah, good, you get this game. Um, this game is D&D &D in video game form. Um, we are a party of four adventurers following little quests here and there and personal quests here and there, leading to one big quest that's like, you gotta save the world as so many D&D &D campaigns do. Small things lead to big things. Um, the thing that we're dealing with is we were kidnapped by a type of monster called a Mind Flayer and they reproduce by putting little parasites in your brain. Happened to us, oopsie doopsie, but we didn't turn into one of them? That's crazy. Um, so in game, you find out why later. I won't say it now in case it's a mild spoiler for you and it's not that big of a deal to know right now. It does give us some psychic abilities with the rest of these other characters in our group. We all have these brain parasites. That's how we met. Now we have a psychic link together. It's awesome. Uh, Karlak and I are dating. Uh, we have used the L word. Um, we're in what you would call a relationship. Uh, wow. And, uh, this is Astarian. He's our vampire monk thief. And this is Shadowheart, our cleric. Cleric. Um, so that's it. So yeah, that's what we're dealing with. And then this character, uh, well, we're covered in blood right now on account of, you know, I'm sure we had to, uh, fight someone or maybe it just came out of our face. Maybe it's our face water. I don't know. Um, well, here's what we, we are doing. We're doing quests. So we are um, actually pretty late in the game right now. And so we're getting to the point where there aren't a whole lot of quests left to do. There are two or three bigger ones right now that I'm kind of excited to um, deal with. But I kind of want to do, there's one where like, it's a major storyline, like overarching quest thing where like, for lack of a better term, the devil. Is that the blood and white die? Yes, it is. Cypher, it is. I like it a lot. Um, That's right. It is, uh, there's the literal devil, and he's like, hey, I have an item you might need. You can make a deal with me to get that item that you definitely need. And we're like, haha, bet, for sure, for sure. Let me just think about it. And then we're like, we're gonna rob this man, right? And it's like, oh yeah, we're gonna rob him for sure. 
So I think I would like to do a robbing. A robbing I would like to do. So uh, we learned that the key to freeing Orpheus, who we need to free, storyline purposes. We'll get into it later. From his chains or in the astral prism in the, is the Orphic Hammer. That's the item we need. It's in Raphael, the devil's possession. So dragging down his lavish abode in the hells, the House of Hope may be our best bet. So that's the thing I think I want to do. So I am curious. I'm going to try. So, oh, here's the other thing. If you're new here, oftentimes I will say things out loud just to um, bring you along for the ride a little bit. You know, I'll go like, oh, man, why would anyone even do that? Oh, I don't even understand. And I'm just doing that to like add some flavor to me walking through. That being said, there are times where I'm going to need your help. And I'm going to say, hey, chat. Hey, specifically chat. People who have played this game before. I need your help right now, please. What the gosh dang hell do I do? That's you'll. That's when you'll know. Um, so right now I need to find my way to H E double heck. Um, I'm and I, there's also parts of the city I haven't explored. This is a whole thing. Um, so I'm going to just explore a little bit and then I'm going to try to find H E double heck. Um, H E double hell. Also where, where are, Ooh, you know what? Our characters are sleepy little guys. They're sleepy little guys. Let's go do a long rest real quick. Let's do a quick long rest. Listen, if I didn't want your unchecked stream of consciousness, I wouldn't be here. Love you, man. Says Enyani. That's extremely supportive, and I appreciate you. Thank you. Never K Soul subscribing for the first time. Welcome to you. Appreciate you. Now, why do they still have us covered in blood? We just, we just changed clothes. I guess I should throw this one. I know throwing water on yourself cleans you up. I'm curious if throwing wine on yourself cleans us up. I don't know why it would, but maybe. Okay, so wine uh, catches fire when it's even remotely near a candle. It is 173 proof. Is that your statue? Oh yeah, that's right. We got a statue of ourselves. The true hero of Baldur's Gate. Why well, didn't it say make me look smarmy? I didn't want to look like a schmuck. But I guess I do. This is not so bad. It's giving. It's giving young Hercules. It's going. I can go the distance. I have often dreamed of a far off place. Stab, stab, stab! With a gray warm welcome. Yeah, that's, that's our character now. Okay, well now we got some order. Great. That is one of those earlier Disney songs that did not have to go as hard as it did. And you're just like, damn, damn. All right, well, I guess there's no water in the world. That's fine. Um, I will quickly pet this owl bear cub. You smell very delicious. But I will not bite It's been you. too long, my friend. Oh, I just want to hold it like a like a flipping bowling ball at the cub. <gasps> Looks like I'm stuck with you. Yes. Fun. Oh, so cute. I love him very much. We've named him Baby Beans. Um, this is a different devil than the one we needed to deal with. Um, she offered us the offer to make smooches at us with her, um, and we said no thank you, and she is, uh, pretty miffed about it. Sucks to suck. What brings you by? How do we get to Raphael's house? Oh, I guess we can just kick her out. That's it. Now nah, I'm all set. All right, well, then we're gonna send our character to bed. Um, oh yeah, I've made this a thirsty area. I'm like, there's a little something for everybody. Mostly. so mad she's decided to stand in your apartment and say and you know what i'm getting better about setting boundaries in my own life i will say probably if this were me i would probably say hey don't do that please no thank you whoa 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 pump the brakes like an old-timey car cypher of tear i think mazora was the only one i didn't get with in my first run cypher of tear my goodness gracious I didn't realize you could do that. I thought for some characters, they were like, mm, I'm a one person person, bucko. That's wild. That's, did you have to look up a way to make that happen? Or were you just like, I will trust my instincts of Riz and make this happen. That's wild. Well done. Well done. Probably just breaking hearts. Oh, I see. I see. Promising them the world. 
but taking from them their oxygen. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. All right, let's get the gosh dang heck out of here. Um, but first, we got to... We got a cast up here. Oh, and also, if there's anybody here who is uh, brand new to this here game, and you're like, I truly don't understand what's going on. Why would you, how are you speaking with animals? What's the deal? It is entirely okay uh, for you to ask questions. You know, uh, we got Kai912. I'm just gonna call you that now. I think that's the easiest way to say your name. Um, gifting us up to Dante GL. Thank you so much for doing that. Appreciate you. Welcome, Dante. Um, I don't understand the game, but I'm here for the vibes. Okay, Demolition Julia. Well, if there's if if there's ever a point where you understand so little about the game that the vibes are not vibing, you just let us know. Um, all right. So we're also going to have Shadowheart do this big old fancy spell now that we have access to, which is basically, please make us a bunch of food, please, on account of magic. And she goes, yeah. Makes us waste room. Great. Great. All right, so we got Damien. Char oh, Damien character is a bard, by the way. And um, if you are a, uh, I, I appreciate it, Cypher. You know what? I'll tell you what, nobody here gets to know until they go to your stream and you decide to tell them if that's what you want to do. There we go. We've incentivized it, but thank you. I mean, you can if you want, but it, you know. I ain't never played D&D in a computery device, but I sure do love it at the table with my friends. It's pastel pink Aussie. You'll probably get most of this then. Like, there is going to be stuff where you're like, oh, that's not really how that spell would work. But for the most part, it's actually pretty... It's pretty... I'd say it's pretty faithful. D&D 5e. As much as you could without absolutely destroying a... A run in some capacity. Have I not explored this? I haven't explored this area. What goodies await up here? What level are we? We are maxed, which is 12. In this game, it's 12, which is not normally how it is in D&D. &D. Yes. Oh, I did. Ooh. So here's another example. Um, you just heard that noise right there, right? And that one as well? So... That is the game actually rolling dice based on our... There we go. Um, yeah, we don't like them, whoever this is. Sneaky guy. So this is a cult that we've been fighting, and that cult we just spotted. Okay, well, now it's a whole thing. I didn't even realize that'd be a thing, but okay. Glad we're here. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, so the game is literally checking, like, did you pass your stealth check? Oh, my God. Not Eugene. Sucks. For Eugene, I mean, I thought we were saving the day, but clearly we didn't even. I'm, I'm sorry. This is a guard. Why are they cowering? That sucks. Is Eugene important? Oh no. Well, I guess we'll. See, I usually skip leg day, and that's on me. All right, we'll tell you what, once it's actually our turn, you guys are in real trouble. I know everybody else gets a turn first, clearly, because you surprised us, which is, you know, rude. Um, okay, so hold up. <gasps> Children's! Stay away from the children. Won't someone think of the children? All right, here's, here's what I'm gonna do. Hellcrawler is in a three meter zone, so hold on. This person is 16 meters away. These kids are 18 meters away. So they would be safe at 15. I'm going to teleport to 14 here to make sure they're safe. I don't want the kids exploding. Because, you know, that happens sometimes. Oh, did I miss that guy? Damn it. The whole point of teleporting was doing that. Oh, well. Defensive flourish. Get rid of this man. Save the kids. Save the cheerleader. Save the world. Nice. We got him. Kids, run. Kids, run! Cyrella, Tam, Skip. The three most important kids. You've got to run now. Anyway, here's Wonderwall. Today is gonna be the day. Da, da, da. Okay, great. Next up is Astarian. He is our monk rogue. Uh, real powerful fellow. Real powerful fellow. Um, Syrian is mean, I guess. As is Balst uh, is a Spalder. 
Okay, great. I almost said ball spalder, which is just real funny. All right, cool. So we're going to do a little, a little chip chop. Oh, they have unstoppable. That's a... Basically, that is a, um, a skill that they have that until you get past that, you're not doing any real damage to them. Um, let's do a little drinky drinky. Yum yum. Um, let's do one more uh, Puncho Kiko. Pow. Boom. Amazing. Astarian, great job. Proud of you. Oh, I forgot about those folks. Okay, right. Oh my god, just killing civilians. Don't. Uh, honestly, stop. Not to cuss, but stop. Wow, what a whole situation we found ourselves in. Um, tell you what, now seems like a good time to go ahead and do my spirit guardians with extra damage. One eight radiant damage. Oh, that's too much. Additional one eight radiant damage per level. Screw it. Let's do a level five. Yeah, let's go nuts. Mm, no, we don't need to. Level four. Let's go. Nice. Once again, extremely not strong out of her. Cool. You know what I can do is uh, protect the kids. Protect the kids. Um, Cyrilla, take the others and run. Cool. Sneaky, dodgy bard, man. Singing wizard fellow. Stop. Keep out of this, Captain. Do not forget who you serve. What's up? Of course. I just thought you might need assistance. I. You feel an all too familiar squirm in the recess. This is not mind. how it's supposed the fist has to a be. But something's off. Not I. We. And we. Do not. So there are other people in the world with other brain Defective. parasites, and they're different. Very well. Another offering to Bob. Okay, so we're getting some story. Okay, and this is the, the mean fellow. And, sh and this person is on our team from the looks of it? But they also have a brain... Parasite of some kind of dog? I don't even know at this point. I'm just gonna murder this fellow. I think it's just time to do a murder at this fellow. Dewey, nice. Um, let's dual wield and just do a stabbins. Pow, pow. Bilbo stabbins, they call me. All right, Astarian, time for you to basically just end this whole match for no reason. Um, Go ahead and do a murder at this person. Nice. Oh, beautiful. Oh, that's absolutely beautiful. You love to see a punch followed by kicking. Pretty cool. Oh, we did a murder, but it was justified. Um, all these go to our camp. Hmm. I would have to jump to get past all of my friends. Actually, no, Carla can just take her turn, huh? Yeah, yeah, I think she just might be able to do that. Cool. Let's have her rage. It's gonna be angry. Toadwatch says, I think this is a great stream for me to start with. I understand everything completely. That's hilarious. Or unless you're being serious and you're like, no, I actually do get it. Um, in which case, great. But I can see how this could be confusing for any, any newbies here. Basically, our girlfriend is stabbing this cult fellow. You know, that's that's just basics of the game here. Okay, so I thought we'd be able to get by. We can't. Can we punch from here? Can we punch from here? We shoot. We sure can't. We have all these bonus actions left. So I'll tell you what. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do step of the wind dash to give myself infinity jumpies. Infinity jumpos. Then a double, triple pound. Nice. Got him. Now that fellow is also dead. We're like, well, there can't be death in this city. Quick, kill everyone else. Um, poor Eugene Kenridge. That sucks. Was there someone else down here? Where, where are the haters? 
Oh, that's right. They're all over here. Shoot. Okay, well, I, I'm going to have a Starion start making his way down here. Minus one HP? Who even gives a heck? Who even gives a heck and gosh darn about that? These jumps are basically free movement for him now, so please that one skill for anyone who's confused. Um, Starion, would you like to do a murder at this person? Ouch. Critical miss? Critical miss. Silly. That's positively silly. Ooh, there's got to be a secret hidden behind this waterfall. I just know it. That's hiding something for sure. That lush, thick waterfall. No, not... Wow, 28 damage. God dang. Um, okay. Uh, Shadowheart. I'm going, I'm going to run down here. Kids, are you, gonna, are you gonna run at all? Or what are you thinking? What are you thinking about running? Uh, even a little bit. Strike in Paul's name. If anyone laughs, if anyone laughs, you're in trouble. Did I send that to camp? I think I did, didn't I? Sure did. <sighs> Damn it. <laughs> that was definitely something I had to read. <laughs> because you're just like, ha ah! ha! I only taught us this in cowering school, sir. All right, well, you're doing a very good job at cowering, I suppose. Um, hey, Shadowheart, what if we uh, rain down ungodly fire on this hater? Here. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, that'll... We went ahead and erased them from um, existence. That's cool. Fist is our friend. Thank God Pard is here. Under his breath, he's like, pardon me. Did you say something, Bart? Uh, no, I said, um, well, yeah, I, I said my, was it your phrase? Yeah, I said my phrase. Um, just thought it'd be a good time for it. No, it was good. It was good. Yeah. Yeah. I think if I heard it, it would have been, it would have landed better. Yeah, for sure. I'll, I'll speak up. Ratui. Nice. Quick. Must be quick. This mind is small. Fragile. Listen now. I can use my brain worm to explore her thoughts, which I think I might just do. Or, or do you want to trade anything? Okay, you got 18 gold. I know we don't have much time. I know time is short and of the essence. I think, though, you probably would want to buy uh, this quill and this towel pile. Um, I feel like they would probably want to buy those two things. I think that makes sense. Yeah. Um, all right, let's do a little trade. Okay, thanks for the two gold. Now you have a quill. Uh, okay, great. Uh, sorry, uh, uh, let me look at your brain real quick. Look at his brain. Oof, there we go. Entering her mind is like stepping aboard a sinking ship. The architecture of her consciousness buckles and collapses. Thoughts yield to a flood of overwhelming power. The okay, not bad for a first love poem. Let's put that as a first draft. Okay, so I'll get you caught up on the story if you're not familiar in a second here. What happened? Why do I taste scops? Thank goodness, her favorite snack, pennies. Oh no! Elaine? Um, okay, well that's too bad that that happened uh, uh, at her. Um, okay, so like I said, we got a brain parasite situation. Oh. Hard, you were too late. Fine. My One second. Who are that lot? Need to report this. Need to get reinforcements. I am the reinforcements, Pard. Worry not. All is well. Your friend is very much dead, but otherwise, all is well. Bloody hells. Who were that lot? And the captain. She's dead. Oh, damn. Captain, eh? Yeah, but he's not cool. Sucks. Um, I wonder if we're able to actually talk to them. Maybe. Let's see. The corpse remains silent. Desi Lou! 
Thank you so much for dropping five flipping gift subs. I appreciate you. Gifting to, oh, hey, it's Aiden, Reynards, Mallory, XOX, uh, Jaws, Whippa, and then Vonderheide761. Thank you so much for doing that, Desilu. I appreciate you. Oodles of much. Very kind of you. Yo, if you were gifted a sub today by anybody and you feel so inclined, drop a thank you in the chat. Or you can keep lurking, and that's okay, too. Um, but, yeah. Um... Oh, it's so ironic that they were the cult of ball, and then there's a ball right there. See, I feel like that's... I feel like that was a hint. I also feel like these kids are rowdy enough that they probably know where that kid that got kidnapped is. Mole. Um... I'm going to go ahead and guess that. Okay, so here's the basic rundown for anyone who's not familiar with the game and is not worried about spoilers, what they were talking about just now. So we've got this big old spooky parasite from a monster called a Mind Flayer. And people have sort of like hijacked that technology to make other spooky parasites for other things. One of them used it for something called an Elder Brain, which is like a giant brain monster. And they started a cult and they want to control everybody by controlling the Elder Brain that's controlling everyone else. So that was a like rival faction. And then we just found out that this cult has their own version of a brain parasite from their spooky old god of like evil murder doo-doo. Um, and that's, that's a whole thing. So that's, that's why they were like, oh, you've killed two of the people already. There's only one guy left. Yeah, because there's only one person left who is doing that plan with the elder brain. Um, all right, let's talk to the kiddos. Oh, they don't even want to talk to us. That's fair. We are strangers. We did commit a murder in front of them in their favor, for sure. So what I'm hearing is everyone has worms. Yes, yes, absolutely. What you're hearing is correct. Everyone does indeed have worms. If they're... If there is not some buried treasure under that tree, my gamer instinct is screaming. My gamer instinct is screaming. Let's go, gamers. Let's go, gamers. Um, clearly, there is some gamer treasure under here. No, no, it's somewhere. No, you, no, you can't fool me. There's no way. Impossible. I'm going to summon my dog, and my dog will tell you that you are a liar. Hey, Scratch. Again, it is a spectral image of a dog. It's not a real dog. If it dies in a game, we don't have to get sad. It still exists in the game, and it is safe, and everything is great. Scratch, there's no... Nothing. Don't make me look like an idiot in front of my fellow gamers. Hey, what's up, Nick? saying meow i'm a good kitty i feel like that was something that your chat made you do just now or you chose to do that as well hi nick uh y'all nick is also a friend of mine another lovely streamer please show nick some love welcome on in buddy hope your birthday was good hope your birthday was good nothing but dirt. Are you kidding me there's nothing to dig up right here i feel so foolish nope it's from the heart big papa i love you so much me so much well then let's hang out I'm, I'm around next week most like i'm around next week most like it's gonna be easier than this week it's good to see you thanks for popping in nick um y'all probably know nick from all over the internet sometimes i shovel at random spots if i suspect a chest you know vonderheide um never once have i been wrong in my life um, in game or otherwise. This was the first time and I can't believe there's nothing there. Um, Desi Lou, thank you again. Speaking of Vonderheide, thanks for gifting us up to Vonderheide. I appreciate you. Oodles. Oodles of several of much. There's gotta be treasure here somewhere, damn it. You're like such an idiot. Oh, I was such a fool. Alright, Carlac. I'm gonna need you to make me not look like an idiot. So we didn't we didn't come here just to Come on, man. <sighs> we need to make our characters fully maxed out with strength. That's the problem. All right. I'm afraid that's solid rock, says Predator H2O. You don't know that, though. There, I've seen illusions in this game. Okay, if they can make an illusion where a friend turns out to be an enemy and vice versa, <laughs> they can definitely make a diggable ground look like the rocks. Oh my god, I haven't been reading tips this entire time. Ah, I'm so sorry. I get laser focused and unfocused at the same time. Where are my ADHD friends at? Um, Casey, thank you for gifting us up to Pro is Pain. Appreciate you. Pro is Pain. Bobby. 
Um, how could you says brony by proxy? How does that work, brony by proxy? Are you a brony or no? Or does your roommate watch My Little Pony Friendship is Friendship? Or something to the effect. Survival fail. Someone's digging some. Oh, I knew it. There it is. Um, alrighty. We got Tiarna dropping 369. Nice. Um, thank you very much, Tiarna. Ooh, fancy scroll. Yes, I'll have that. Okay, it was good. Oh, I should definitely also go to camp real quick and read the thing that I 100% skipped um, by sending it to camp and not actually doing it. <gasps> Bird! Sorry. Um, oh, I think that term, Andrew, I think that's fine because it's the name of a sports team. No, it's not. Never mind. <gasps> I don't know. Whatever. Um, all right. We got Tiana. Thank you very much, Tiana, saying, uh, hey, mate, happy Thursday. Um, it is thursday soon for me and definitely thursday for you in straya unless you're 17 hours behind but i think you're ahead you're ahead yeah um do a long rest because i might as well why not? uh hey mate happy thursday so i gave one of the ridiculous shirts to both my bosses i'm an executive assistant and they loved it they promised to get me back soon haha -ha. as always sending my love to you the chat and the coop that's awesome tiarna i love that you're getting mileage out of this so for anyone who's new here, uh, Tiarna, one of our uh, audience members of the Clever Coop, uh, is doing a gag gift for everyone in their life this year. Um, it is a shirt with their face on it, um, and they're giving it to people all at once to like open all at once. It's like, surprise, I got dozens and dozens of these. Um, basically, it's, it's just merch. You got your own merch, um, which is so clever and so fun. Um, ooh, Carlac and I woke up next to each other. <laughs> Mommy and daddy wrestling right there. That's what that's called. Now we have to redo all of our stuff again. Gosh dang it. Gosh dang it. OMG, I have merch. I mean, kind of, Tiarna. I think it seems like it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What happened? It's not Bertram! Oh, yeah, they got shot earlier. It's fine. I mean, it's not, it's not fine at all, but, like, we knew that. This isn't new news. We're already sad about it, or whatever. Why does it take a minute for me to be able to, um, summon Scratch? Just summon the best boy, but it doesn't let me do it. I didn't even read the thing I was supposed to read. God dang it. Latest. What did I? Okay. Strike in Ball's name. Nobody laugh. If you laugh, you're immature. Um. All right. I guess I'm gonna go recent here too. No. No. Yes. Strike in Ball's name. Oh, devotees of untimely death! It's time to skin, to fly, to make our presence felt. The terror must not wane. Those arrogant adventurers make a bloody example of them. Tear them to gobbit. I will ensure that the hapless fist stay out of it. And if any bystanders suffer unintended maiming or death, well, oh, that's simply an offering to pay you all my dear boy. <laughs> oh. That's uh, their name. Sent to camp. Okay, so we read it and it didn't do anything for storyline and now we're fine. Great. Arrivederci, camp. Um, I'm gonna keep going west. You know what? This might be a mostly city exploration stream because like I said, it's not gonna be the longest one So why put any pressure on what we have to get done? Ooh, bold snakes. Yes, I would like an egg in this trying time. But thank you Not at all how I thought that would happen, but okay, bud I think maybe that's the coolest thing about fantasy games and stuff you know, not like magic and knights and wizards and all that good stuff, but just like you can just walk around. Sometimes there's an egg and you're like, oh, never mind. You know, it's pretty cool. Very, very good. But now we can summon our doggo friend. And now Shadowheart can make a, a nice meal for us. Excuse me, I'm sorry. I just gotta get through. We are filling it. Stop. Yum, yum, yum. And again. Mmm. Great, now we all have extra HP. Everything's good to go. Rat trouble. 
Like Take that then. The Very normal, not unhinged behavior. Smarmy swaggerer boots, the best boots in the game, clearly. Backpack, Dora's map is in there. If she wants it back, she'll leave a thousand dollars in unmarked bills in my pocket. Veronica Hamperclips, you made that name up. Hamperclips, who's been tumbled by a demeaning and wet, mean spirited husband into having more children than she wanted. Now it seems she's ceaselessly spending her days at a wash basin, cleaning a never ending supply of dirty things. That's just called adulthood in 2023. She escapes this when she solves the unsolvable riddle of the almost disturbingly handsome fairy prince, Raigl. This to a world of Oh, this is some fantasy smut. Nice. Nice. Um okay, Shadowheart wants to say a thing. That graffiti from before. I never thought I'd see it again. It said for a good time, call Richard. Thought I'd call Richard again. Um, why does it stand out? Well, I think I was the one who did it. <gasps> Nani the heck? I can recognize my own handwriting. Kombucha's gonna explode. How Ooh. long ago was this? Years? All the time I spent training, hidden away from the world. I think, I think I must have wanted to leave my mark somewhere. Just to prove I existed, even to myself. So for anyone who's confused on storyline stuff, nine times out of 10 in this game, in this game if, if a character's talking about something and you don't know what's going on, they have either lost their path in belief of religion or society, um, or they have been betrayed, or they've been brainwashed. This one's uh, a little combo of all three. Um, but she's like now remembering, she's like, oh, my memories were all weird before, oops. Um, Oh, that's not even a continuation of the thing. She just wanted to have some storyline coloring. Is that why your hair is white now? You know what, Ryan Accord, just in, Ryan Accord, just in case someone hasn't played before and wants to, I'm not gonna say why your hair is white. I will say, um, for anyone who wants to get caught up from the very beginning, I was uploading VODs to YouTube. Um, they're still up. I think there's like 12 episodes now. Um, that fell off because I got very busy and that was the absolute first thing to go, but I will get back to it very, very soon. That is the plan. Um, but, uh, yeah, that's a thing. That's a thing. Um, okay, cool. Thanks, Shadowheart, for letting me know how you feel about things. I always love open communication. I just wish you also had more of a reason to say it. Um, yeah, so I'm going to keep exploring, and if we happen to find a path to Raphael's house, great. And if not, then we'll save that for another time. Um, I can't go through the word, or can I? <gasps> Rat! Rato, messenger rat. There's creeps in cloaks creeping around down in the sewers. Yeah, we we knew that for sure. We actually murdered. I'd say, if not most of them, then like en enough for it to be a problem for them for like a while. Um. All right. Oh. Yeah, keep training. Keep training. Big. Who is this? Oh, we're gonna talk to this person. We're gonna be like, hey, nice sword arm. Hey, we got Aitza Pizza, pizza dropping a 10 limit to give subs. Thank you very much, Aitza pizza, pizza. Appreciate you. Gifting to Mackenzie Claire, Biochem Abby, The Pro Bro, Steph, uh, Abril, Abril del, del Cielo. Cielo? Angel? Cielo? Oh. Stop a moment. You got it. Scott Pilgrim's right. the third X he has to fight, enough. fourth X he has to fight. The commander keeps an open house, so you may pass. Cool. Um, uh, the, the, uh, V Vindria, uh, hey, Salomoon, uh, Path Rifter, Laya Sylvester, and then BD Kai. Um, I eat some pizza. Thank you so much for the generous sub, Mama. I appreciate you. Appreciate you very many, several. Sky slash heaven. Ah, cielo. I was close. What is angel? Is it, Ange is it just on on him? Seraph something? It's just angel. Okay, cielo is heaven. Got it, got it, got it. Well, I was, I was right vibes. All right. So April of heaven, El Cielo. April from heaven. There we go. Thank you. Um, thank you for the sub, Mama Eats Pizza. Appreciate you. Right. Who's the commander? We we have been looking for a kid named Mole who got kidnapped way too long ago for us to still be like, I don't know, maybe she's around. Like, we should probably know for sure at this point. So I'm assuming maybe Mole is the commander. Maybe Mole moved to Baldur's Gate and is raising a kid army, which usually ends very well. 
Sounded good. Could be more. So be nice to Ryan, or I'll kick you out. Be blowing in love. You live in Los Angeles? Oh, Bringing God damn it. Writing is hard. Wow. <laughs> yep. I just hurt my own feelings. Yep. Spanish for angel is angels. Because I live in Los Angeles. <laughs> okay, thank you. Um, all right. They said I can pass, so I'm going to do it. Mm. Wooden chest. Well, and we wouldn't get a penalty for lockpicking? No penalty for lockpicking. Okay. Okay, so they really like us here right off the bat. That's pretty cool. Let's, um... I'm sure I, I'm sure they get this all the time, but let's rob these kids. Um... Sleep well, Cypher. Thank you so much. Oh, and thank you for leaving a tab open. You're very sweet. You did not have to do that. Uh, be well, enjoy, and whenever your next stream may be, have a good one. Letter to Rion. Oh, please be signed by Mole. It's in the camp again! I did it! Ah! Okay, well, I don't need these kids' money. I'm not gonna take their money. I will go to camp real quick. Cause God dang it. God dang it. <sighs> Latest. That's a Tyrion. Okay. Rion. It's not by Mole. Um, Rion. We have had no further word from the High Harper since she gathered her forces and snuck out east. Struck out east. While her sending to you is currently concerning, she made no such contact with us. And I cannot believe that Jahira Wiener would fail to pass on all she knew if she truly believed the end was at hand. Your mother will be fine. She always is. Hadges Ree, High Harper of Cloakwood Chapter. Great, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna take that back. And then we're gonna leave camp. It's great. Oh, I used to pizza. That's so sweet. I kind of feel awkward sometimes in chat, like IDK what to say sometimes. So gifting the community makes me feel part of it. And it's nice. Ooh, I used to pizza. That's very sweet. And I'll, and I'll say this. You never have to say anything, but also there's not really a wrong answer if it's just part of the conversation. If you got something to say, great. If you don't, that's okay too. Like there's no obligation, but I think it's very sweet that you are contributing in the way that you have. And I appreciate it a lot. Um, so thank you. Ooh, I've succeeded in perceiving, but what did I perceive? Damn it. The one colossal flaw with this game. Like you perceive. Where? No. Got some plans. Oh, loose plank. Well, that's gotta be it. Go for the eyes. Great. Loose plank. Unsent sending. No, read it. Short note, marked up as a professional sending, a magical message of up to 25 words intended to find the recipient wherever they might be. This copy was never given over to a cleric for delivery. No, I don't know what to do. So come back and tell me or I'll come find you. Death will not protect you, idiot. We don't know what voice to give them. There it is. <laughs> oh, no. This is how I talk. Rose of Hopes. Mysterious moonshade. All right. Yeah, I'll just take. I want these books. I've stolen from them the greatest gift of all: knowledge. Oh, I'm I'm encumbered. So basically, in this game as well, which is something you don't usually see in D and D, if we try our best to have fun, um, <laughs> there's encumbrance. Um. Which means, um, oh god, this is a good, wait. Duelist prerogative, oh, that's right, I have this. I gotta send that to camp though. Um, you can get weighed down too much, basically. Um, you can just get weighed down too much, so. We don't wanna do that. Got too much stuff in my bag here. You know what'll really help is sending all this money over to Carlac, who can definitely handle it, because she is really good at carrying stuff, and I'm a, I'm a weak little fellow. Cupboard. <gasps> Hello, Rathen residence backdoor key. I mean, we need no keys, but like, okay, sure. We we pick locks in this in this. Oh. Okay. Yeah, are we still doing the thing where you say, hey, if you had a certain person, that would be a good plan? I think that's fair, Kitty Kiljoy. I don't think that's too much of a spoiler, and they did specifically mention Jahira. Do I need to have Jahira while I'm in this home? Is that a thing that should probably happen? Oh, Jehesim. I'm, I would imagine. Yes, Gitter, you should, you should, you should. Okay, got it. Done. 
the camp we go. You might want to get her. Yeah, thank you very much. Well, Shadowheart has some story stuff here, too. I hate to say Arriva Verce to Karlak because we love her so much, but um, Jahira will fill her role since we gave her the ability to Paladin. Karlak? Oh, she's rehearsing a, a speech. Yes, I'm on your Darling. mind. <sighs> we'll need to stay behind in camp for now. Sounds boring. You heard me. Oh, fine. I'll be here eating dirt or whatever. Hello? Oh. Now we shall speak to Jahira, who's wearing some wicked armor. Yes? Uh, join me. As you wish. <laughs> Suddenly she's granting wishes. Uh, let me just make sure we have um, enough goodies on her. We don't. We have zero goodies on her. What should you wear? That's pretty good. That looks like something you could wear feasibly. We don't have any extra cloaks. Okay. What do we have for the Huns? Brachnir Bracers. Strength saving throws. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I mean, that's pretty good. Oh. Oh, that's awesome. No, flawed hell dust gloves. Hell yeah, you're wearing those. We're obviously going to make her helmet go off. Go off, sis. Um, jump spell, arc, razor, phone for us. Uh, these two need to actually go to camp. We don't need these at all. Um, that's good for sorcerers. We don't have one. Um, full damage. Set yourself on fire can't be electrocuted that's pretty good just for a quick thing i don't think we'll be having to battle too much oh no okay yeah i think i think we should just probably go you gain advantage on insight checks sure done um dominate beast great we got it we can sure dominate that beast um finally uh <laughs> advantage on saving throw. these are all actually really good uh gust of wind great amulet of the wind rider awesome sick cool done we got it easy peasy squeezy lemons um is it bad on ps5 asks nyquist i don't think so i had a hard time because i'm enjoying mouse and keyboard and it was hard for me to switch to controller um but other people prefer it with controller so it just depends oh we're back surprise. oh Mahler's mark and ambush oh are we quite sure she hasn't actually died this time brother she looks dead mm. smells it too Ooh. Okay, rude. It I guess we would probably kill these people anyway for being rude to our girl. But I can girl, kick you both around the ear to prove I am no ghost, if it would help. Forgive us, mother. We're just surprised you still know how to find your way home. Okay, I didn't order any sass. That's so weird. Candide, uh, Cass, basically we're doing some side quests right now as we finish up the game. But if you're not familiar with the game at all, it's D&D. &D. We're in Act 3 of a three-act game. Um... We're a no spoiler stream until we get to things. Um, and uh, that's basically it. I'm exploring parts of the city I haven't seen before. So I'm seeing sort of what I stumble upon because I uh, don't have the most time to stream today. So there we are. Did anyone ask about the hat? It's Nightmare Before Christmas, but it's too small. So you can't really see it because Jack Skellington's whole head is my whole head and a half. Um, mother. The hero. These are your children. Um, she always brings the smartest people home, too. Enough, Ryan. I taught you better manners than that. No, you didn't. A sending spell can carry 25 words. Do you know how many Jahira's only message contained in all this time she's been away? Seven. This really isn't any of my business. Now, there is a phrase Jahira has never uttered, Ooh. but no. The message went, I'm sorry, you know what to do. So why haven't you done it? You were supposed to get the young ones out of the city. Yeah, we had to save like and three. And you were supposed to be dead. That's what your oh-so-stoic message meant, yes? Yet here you are. So, what happened out there? I got my skin saved by this one. 
We've come to take the fight to the cult. Which is exactly why you all cannot be here. Why? You plan on winning, don't you? You're the one who saved us, so tell me. Are we all doomed? Not in this lifetime. That's so heroic for the moment where I'm like, this really isn't any of my business. But are you going to be saved? Yes, by me. No. Um, the cult is powerful. It's not going to be an easy fight. So fight. That's what all you heroes and harpers are for, isn't it? You Jeez, they're being so rude. You know what, Iridescent W? I feel girl. like if, if my mom uh, took uh, off for like a while, it was house, just like, remember? be back. Then You'll keep a civil tongue under our roof if we let you stay at all honestly i think they're putting down healthy ba Have boundaries with a parent sister. who did not show up for them she's old after all so old i Seems thought I'm outvoted. that was See, one of the short that folk either a gnome or a halfling and that is a human family. elf child now if there's more to discuss then bloody well come in and wipe your boots you've stepped in our doo-doo trap <laughs> um all right that, okay yeah that was i think their rudeness is justified for sure i also think jahira kind of sucks for not at all being like because nothing's happening like right now we're not saving the world in this moment so when she's like get out of here go you have to go it's like you can at least say hi sorry you know um we got sammy antha dropping 369 nice uh thank you very much sammy antha saying Hi, Damien. Thank you for always being he here to help lighten my day or even being a background noise when I do much needed work. I wanted to ask, thank you very much. That's very sweet. Um, I wanted to ask if you sang at all. I know you have honey stuff for your throat to help your voice. So I was curious. Yeah, I do sing now and then, but it's mostly for me. I oddly enough, a couple of the voiceover auditions I have to do tonight, not, not too long from now, um, require singing. So it's just like, huh, it's funny how that works out. But, um, I do and I enjoy it, but I do it for like for me like i don't think i would ever be like i'm gonna start a band and release an ep you know i just get too nervous i'm not you confident enough in it to like enjoy it in the moment the recently you know Save some for the others that's what? a fair question excuse me thank you so much though for asking and i'm glad i can help be a distraction when you're having a bummer Cut time you just need to get work done wow does every house there. just have 17 entrances oh no this is a beautiful Oh God, I want this library. A meandering letter from a traveler to her family back home. The main text is marred with scratches and corrections, a code translated in a firm hand down below. Hi Harper, movement in the Shadowlands confirmed. Absolute cultists pass where the shadows are deepest. No clue as to how and no means to follow. Lights spied in Moonrise Tower from afar and great movement of forces through the dark. They are gathering an army. Bring more hoppers. Bring means of making light quickly. Yeah, we already dealt with all that stuff. Final warning. Well, got it. What's that? Beloved Ranger bewitched. Oh, got it. So there's a spooky old evil version of Jahira that's been meandering about. Oh. <gasps> no way. We found a Harper's pin at the beginning of the game. I swear to God, if this is what needs to go in there. What the hell? That we held on to that for so long. There was no indication at all that that was going to be needed it just it looked different than other things we found we could have sold it i can't believe that that's insane okay let's go out into the hideout then i guess what they got one of those gear i don't know what it is we'll see you in a minute um okay wild we got uh small town singer 316 dropping 369 nice uh thank you very much small town singer saying had so much fun playing jackbox uh trivia murder party with you last stream that was awesome yes it was such a lovely time thank you for joining uh currently dealing with several significant bad things in my personal life and these streams have been some of the only times i've been able to disconnect and have fun 
Thanks for being my escape. Well, I'm very sorry to hear that personal life stuff is going down. Sometimes, like, one thing just informs the other, and it snowballs, and, like, maybe you could handle one thing at a time, but when it's a bunch at once, it just sucks. So I'm sorry to hear that. But I am, as always, very happy that this can be an escape for you. Um, and, yeah, regarding Jackbox, you know, pretty soon here, we're going to finish Baldur's Gate, and we'll start adding more games to the mix again. I've got fun plans for 2024 streaming. It's going to be grand old time. Oh, dear. Granite rock disarm. Okay. Well, glad I found that real quick. But if you do not trust me, take the weight from the pressure plate there. Oh, she wants us to take the weight from it. Oh. Okay. Can't slow down. Why can't I move? What's what is literally going on? I never dreamed our noble Jahira would be such a terrible, terrible mother. It's nice to see heroes are as awful as the rest of us, hmm? Yeah, for sure. Um, all right, well, we did the thing. We did disarm it. Yeah, Baldur's bugs. I guess so. Well, buggy. Anastarian's getting some CS. What do you think, Shadowheart? Jahira's adept at keeping secrets, and for good reason. She was wise to try and keep her family safe. I just wish I could have done the same. You could have just said something else, though. I don't know. Yes? Why didn't you tell me about your family? Hmm. I have given you much reason to think that Harper's hoard secrets like precious stones. But I promise you, this was not some intrigue. Just, uh... Plain and simple foolishness. As if by keeping clear of my family, I might keep them clear of the cult in turn. That's not how that and works. If this fight were to go against us, well, they had already done their mourning. Why well, visit it on them twice? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I mean, I, I get her logic. Her logic is logicking, but I don't agree with it. At all. Admit it, you were just afraid of Ryan. Uh, one of their kids. Of course I was. You met her, did you not? That's fun. The girl had opinions before she had teeth. I was wrong to think I could keep my ah, children from funny. this fight. They're Baldorian born and bred. The only damned reason I root myself in this place. This city is a cesspit. An open sewer of the soul that taints us with its filth and churns us out when all that is good has been stripped away. Mm. It also happens to be their home. And so it is mine. Ugh. That might be the first time I have said that out loud. Oh. Now come. We had best get to saving it. Lest Ryan turn her ire on us both. All right. Yeah, I think because we just saw a bunch of civilians get killed by that cult for no reason. I, I think the whole thing about Jahira keeping them safe by not being there is, is um, some bull dangus. Some bull dinky. Wow, all sorts of things to explore. Here. The threats aren't meant for you. But uh, better to stick close, eh? Um, what if we just jumped over there? <laughs> Feather fall, so we don't take fall damage. Um, yeah, that's what I'll do. Come on, everyone! Wow! <gasps> animals! Oh, animal friend. Animal friend. Postmaster badger? And messenger rats? The arch druid's eyes and ears have fallen away in her absence. I am training new ones. Oh yeah, we killed the old arch druid because she sucked. I bring word of gnomes. Gnomes in the sea. We already dealt with that. Down by the blushing mermaid, there's a stink of something fey. We Smell already dealt with that too. too. Boss doesn't care Were these all for that. me? 
There's been killings in a holy place. Sticks of incense and blood. We've done all of those. Oh. If you are not meant to be here, the Archdruid's traps will see to you. If you have Did you hear an Archdruid? About it. If you do not, poke around and see what happens. Oh, nice she is. Then. Okay. Now then smile. Growl. Oh, she would need to have speak. God, yes. 13 of these. Yeah, I think we can uh, I think we can afford to give uh a one or two to Jahira. We just need one. Okay, fine. Two there. Um, all right, you hear? You hear an animal talking? Well, that's because you drank that potion. Arch Druid. It's good to have you home. The new informants are coming along. That was very little payoff. Wish to live in Let's try again. Times. One more time. Arch. Nope. Okay. Still breathing. Very it's cool. Very cool. <laughs> They got little mushroom houses. Oh, this is the best. Do we just get to end the game right here and just hang out with these guys forever? I would. Excuse me. Some no these. How much farther can I go? Here, uh, sorry, I re sorry, I request. It's true. I am paladin now. I believe in God, not nature. I went to a meeting that turned out to be religious in nature, and what can I say? I had a good time. At first, it was for community, but their ideas make a lot of sense. Let's steal from a friend. Steal from a friend. Steal from a friend. Steal from the burlap sack. Hey, we got 500 bits coming from Captain Murphy. Thank you very much, Captain Murphy. I appreciate you. Um, let's send this to the heart. There we go. Now I can walk around. Who did, who perceived something? Someone perceived something. Ooh, armillary sphere. What are they called again? Anulax batteries. Arbulary batteries. Um, I think arbulary batteries is the best line in all of Marvel films. Uh, Captain Murphy, thank you again for the 500 bits. That was very, very nice of you. Feel the spinning. Um, all right. Uh, Kels D brings up a great question. I want to make this very clear for everybody. If I just leave the stream on, is it still beneficial even if I don't subscribe? I usually leave them up while I work or sometimes just misplace my phone, but sometimes I feel like a creep for not engaging. So, Kels D, I want to make this as clear as possible. Thank you so much for watching the stream. You can chat, you can not chat, you can leave it open, you can subscribe, you can not subscribe, you can go do your thing and turn your phone off. All of those things are okay. It is not your job or your responsibility to benefit me. It's nice that you're here and even saying hi. And even there, there are viewers that we have that have never said hi in chat. That's why we say we love our lurkers. So don't you worry. Uh, don't, don't pay it another thought. Thank you for saying hi. Thank you for being here. And there's no wrong answer. You are good to go. Okay, so, oh, okay, got I gotta disarm this whole situation. Oh, there's a lot of stuff to disarm. Great, so Starion, why don't you go ahead and be our disarmor fellow? Sneaky, sneaky fellow, sneaky, sneaky fellow. Um, all right. We got Wisteria dropping three bucks. Thank you very much, Wisteria. I appreciate you saying hi. I hope you're having a great day. I am, thank you. I got new hearing aids today and discovered for the first time that some lamps make the cutest little electricity sounds. Yes, they do. Um, not everybody hears those particularly well, though. So I wonder if you're just more sensitive to that frequency with those hearing aids. That's very interesting. Um, but congrats on that must be huge. Um, I may or may not have cried over a lamp. Lol, lovely to hear your voice properly this time. Oh, Wisteria. Oh, my God. Wow. Wow, I just got that hit me. Wisteria, thank you. That's so special. I love that. Um, congratulations. That's so cool. Thanks for sharing that with us today. Yeah, not everybody. I don't think everybody hears electricity particularly well, but I can always tell if like a TV is on or a lamp is on. 
and what have you. So, um, maybe that's just how you're wired, or maybe that's how your e hearing aids do things. Um. Ooh, yes, 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 yes. A crooked what touch. Heck? Oh, but it's a door. It was a door the whole time. Door the whole time. It was a door the whole time. Uh, oh, the ball spawn saga too. My dearest wife. Oh, was Jahira married? Or is this to Jahira? Khalid. Since you've forbidden the writing of poems, I had to get creative this year. I tracked down a retired Cormirian war wizard with a magical method of transferring mental imagery to parchment. The art is imperfect and perhaps better suited to espionage than name day gifts. With all my love, and from a safe distance, Kelly. Beneath the note, a small inked picture of a smiling couple, their mouths agape far too widely, their joints twisting ever so slightly. Ugh, but beneath a disoriented brows, you can just make out a much younger Jahira and a bearded man wearing a harper pin. Oh. Oh, we're giving that to Jahira. I want Jahira to read that. Go, be emotional in front of us. Khalid was her husband in the first game. Okay, I figured I figured they would establish that. That does make sense. Thank you very much. Okay, they don't make Jahira sad just by reading that. Okay. Cool lore. Thank you. I'm also assuming there's still going to be traps in here. God, to be one of these fluttery little butterflies moths living in here when it's sealed behind a bookcase and i guess there's a source of light they've probably probably got a way out um right of the timeless body right We're of the timeless body what's that about i'd best ask jahira it's a yoga <laughs> instructional video you want to live for Ever? Well, you better stretch every day. Um, there's a lever. Woo! Khalid's gift. Oh, while well, we're in Khalid's gift, Jahira cannot be cursed. Plus one wisdom. Khalid's gift aid. Oh, okay. We're going to have her wear that instead, obviously. Just for... Oh, wait. I can give this to any character? <gasps> oh, that's awesome. Except for Jahira. I guess. A gift from my husband. I've had to renew parts over the years, but the heart remains the same as the day he gave it to me. You saying you got like filler or like what? Um, okay. Jahira, Khalid's gift. Well, I guess we can just do this. Wow, big deal, big deal. Type. Okay, there we go. The yoga position you do is determined by the roll of the dice. God, if if I were fit enough to do something like that, where it's like, oh, how many push-ups am I gonna do? Roll in the D20. It's like, no, you get a specific amount you get to do. Um, opulent chest. Whoa! Oh, that's awesome. Um, Belm. Hold on. Well, let's. What? Why? Hold on. Staff of the ring. Why would you lock these away? Weapon and shaman plus two. Perfectly balanced strike. Perfectly balanced. As all things should be. Um. Oh my god. Okay, so that's 2d6 plus seven. Send Belm snaking out with an adder speed, the very exemplar of swiftness embodied in steel. You can do it once per turn? Bro, that's actually insane. It's a bo it's a bonus action. That's absurd. That's so much damage. That's a disrespectful amount of damage. And then, okay. And then, what was the other one? Death Ram once per turn, the blow possibly knocks the foe back and stuns them. Has no effect on dragons or huge creatures. I guess that would be. Um, if you were using a monk that uh, used like martial weaponry. That's bonkers, Desune. Sorry. Um, let me see this for 
Okay, well, let's swap to Damien character and see how no, he likes it. Yet. Let's swap to you and see how you like it, mister. Um, okay, so still not nearly as good as what I got going on, but st that's... The attack itself is insane, though. How about you? 9 to 12 versus... Well, I guess this can't be... It is It is light, so it could be an offhand versus this. Uh, the number you need to roll a crit is reduced by 1. This effect can stack. But see, even that is not... Not that great. True strike doesn't matter that much. We're not really using it. Uh, when a creature misses you with a melee attack, you can retaliate with true strike. So I think the only benefit to this is like I could throw it and it would return to me, which is a thing, and that's fine. And it also gives me armor class plus one, but our armor class is so high already. Like, I'm kind of okay swapping it. Like, this feels like it would be a better move. Good balance drop. I mean, like, that's... Yeah, I think I think that's what I'm gonna do. Cause I don't really care about the critical strike thing. Like we don't need to crit that often and we don't crit that often and that's fine. Oh, perfect. I'm sorry, perfectly balanced strike only does 10 to 18 with this one? That's very weird. Oh. Well then never mind. That's just an extra attack. Okay. Hmm. Huh, that's really weird. I don't know why it's doing that. I guess Jahira would do more damage with that weapon, and that's the point. Because it's her special little weapon. Hello. Um, yeah, that's probably it. That's probably it. So Jahira would do way more weapon. But it's an offhand only. Because it's offhand. Got it. Thank you. Okay. Work to be done. Work to be done. Um, let's check with Jahira real quick, and then I think we're done with that little area. Never a dull moment. Yes? Oh, in main hand, it's nuts. Oh, that's what you're saying. Thank you. I found a strange scroll in your sanctuary. Something about a timeless body. The threat of spanking never kept the children from poking through my things. Why should it deter you? It Promise. is a ritual, or it describes one at least, practiced by druids of certain esoteric circles. If they be learned and powerful enough, the practitioner of this ritual might slow their aging, extend their life well beyond its natural reach. It is not something you need concern yourself with. <laughs> I've picked up stranger things in all my travels. Trust me. Stranger things reference! Stranger things reference! Um care to discuss that scroll of yours if you wish it's uh possible i was a little too quick to judge a little too caught up in ceremony it is a ritual yep. if they be learned then yep. it is not something yep. you need concern yourself with okay great weird um all right uh okay so you were saying because it's in my offhand that's why it sucked but in my main hand here Crimson Mischief. This is a main hand only, and I do like my main hand weapon, so I don't think I want to swap it. But let's see here. 11 to 22. Uh, this weapon deals an additional damage to those who are a little bit weak. When you make an attack with advantage, you get extra damage. It's all really good stuff, to be honest. 11 to 22 versus... Yeah, it's still 9 to 14 in that case, which is weird. I'm gonna hold on to my Crimson Mischief. That's just the one ability it has an offhand. Oh, crim oh it has an offhand ability too. Sorry. Um, when you make an attack with your offhand weapon, you can add your ability modifier da to the damage of the attack. Oh, that's pretty good. Our ability modifier is. Um... Always forget. It's like plus four. That's actually really good. Um, okay, well then let's see. We got 11 to 22 with 9 to 12. Now let's try this. Let's swap this real quick. Oh, just him. 11 to 22 versus 9 to 12. And now we've got 9 to 14 and still 11 to 22. I'm all set. I think I'm okay. I don't need to use the fancy boy sword. We can have this go to Jahira and we're good. Um, let's sort by weight because obviously I have way too much on my person right now and I don't know why. 
that interruption. We don't need it. Um, the grilled pork. We don't need it. Um, we have torch of uh, revocation. We are we have it equipped. We're using it. Um, these boots to the camp they go. This bread to the camp they go. Don't swallow the stress of it. Um, we don't need this fiddle. Okay, I think I think we're good now. Probably. It's so weird that he's. I guess it's just the alchemy pouch stuff, or water too. This can go to Shadowheart. Great. Um, hey, we got particular list dropping five flipping gift subs. Thank you very much, particular list. I appreciate you. Particular list is gifting to Groovy twenty three, heroic dead guy, Mafia Ducks, uh, B I M, and then uh, Zobi Juan Kenobi seventy seven. Thank you very much, particular list. I appreciate you, oodles of mud. Very many several. Severals of thank you. Um, right of the timeless body. I'm going to read it. Confused spread of cryptic symbols coupled together within the same hand seemingly over the years. Okay, cool. Um, great. Great, 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 great. Uh, mushroom soup. Mushroom soup. Mushroom soup. Whatever could it mean? It means you've lived a life of sin. Um, okay, cool. The camp. Send it to camp. Okay, now we have less on us. Great. They should have weaponized the bread. They already weaponized the salami. A lap sack. Or the wolf books. Ball spawn. We don't care. Pouch. There and then burlap sack. We can't reach it. Great. I think we've done everything in this little location. Can hardly feel the spinning. Oh, ho, ho, ho. A heavy chair. Black and furnace red dye. Oh, who knew you were such a fashionista? These boots have seen everything. Well, goodbye, Badger. Have fun living in this location for another hundred thousand years. I don't know how long you've been alive, and that's okay. Everything's fine. On um, particular list, thank you again. That was very, very sweet of you. There ought to be supplies here to aid us. There were. We, we took him. Wow, what a cool thing to have found. Like, to have that pin pay off, where, again, we were pretty much in the entirety of the game, we were holding on to that thing, being like, I'm sure it'll be useful at some point. And then, lo and behold, Lindsay, lo and behold, it was. Anything in here? No. Getting through there? Nope. Can I go through there? Nope. What a wild game. What a wild game. Coded field report. No, we're good. Okay, battle plans. Uh, let's talk to the different people. See, this is the just exploring a little bit in this game led to this entire side area. And thank you, y'all. That was just the right amount of allowed backseat gaming when you were like, you might want to have to hear for this part. Like, that's great. It wasn't a spoiler. It was just a, a better experience. So thank you. I take no responsibility for your plants. You know I'm more of a mushroom man. That's true, and mushrooms are not plants. You let my study turn into a thicket. Is this what I am hearing? They thought you were dead. I tended to it. I just let it thrive in its own independence. You know, same way you raised us. I raised you to be a sweet and kind boy. What happened? I watched what you did instead of listening to what you said. This house has taken in a lot of children over the years. Mother dear was sometimes more commander than, well, mother dear. Okay, so obviously it's great. She seems to have been taking in a lot of kids um, that like otherwise didn't have a place to go, becoming mother to them. That's pretty cool and pretty special, so I respect her for that. It does also kind of sound like they were latchkey kids because she's like, mommy's off saving the world. And it's like, well, that, damn, you're doing a really good thing, but also maybe it's, maybe you should be there for them. But also I know you have to save the world. It's, it's tough, but I get why everyone's being a little bit sassy. They're allowed to be mad. And sometimes a parent can do the best they possibly can. You can still be mad. Um, hey, everybody, please give spicy. Clever Coop welcomes to Fish Sticks and Me Flow. Uh, both subscribing for the first time to tier one. Thank you so much. Appreciate you a lot. So you're all Jahira's wards. Wards, family, lifelong irritants. Use whichever term you wish. 
We were down the market when I was about nine years old. Some merchant started in with the usual. Yes, but where's your family? Whose son are you, really? When mother was done with him... Yeah, I do well, like to hear her. Let's say he won't have any sons of his own to worry about. Hm. I stole his wiener well and threw it in a river. Alrighty. Let's see here. We've also got another new subscriber. We got Gasp Judas. <gasps> Judas. Um, mur murder. <gasps> Judas. Uh, subscribe for the first time. Welcome to you. Thank you. That what a fun name. That's a, That's actually a great name. I'm surprised. How early did you have to make a Twitch account to get that? That's wild to me. Excuse me. Burping again. I do be burping. That's what happens with kombucha. Dwarven ta I thought that said Dwarven Taxidermy, and I'm like, I am in the wrong building. Oh, no. Uh, ma voix, invocation. Read. Cool. We don't need any of that. Oh, come on, Ferdinand. I just trimmed you. Uh, let's see what's upstairs. Probably a bunch of things to steal, is my guess. Gummy mate. Sawed the maimed god? That no, sounds sick. Reading like a strange cross between a warped confession and a manifesto. <laughs> this text was written by a paladin who broke his oath of justice and celibacy to tear. <gasps> he made smooches? After years of devotion, it seems the man grew very sullen with the state of his life. Well, I'm counting no smooches. People did not like his religious ardor, nor the ardor itself, but the stringency of his tone. Um, not the ardor itself, but the see of his tone. Evidently, he got drunk one night in spring and attacked a young woman walking the streets of her hometown. Ironically, he was gelded by the authority. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Dark, sad, holy beans. Uh, we're going to move on to a different topic. Look at all these things. Uh, Forgotten Forest. I remember it now. Dark children's picture book featuring a host of animal friends helping one another survive a forbidding forest. Not foreboding, a forbidden or for... Never heard forbidding forest. Forbidden or foreboding. At just the moments where it seems the villains have the advantage, that a childish hand has drawn a cranky old elven woman beating them. Aww. They're like, oh, it's Jahira. She's going to come save the day. That's very sweet. Not a whole lot of great stuff to rob yet, though. Haha. <laughs> um... All right. Stinky clothes. Stinky, stinky. Uh, I'm just going to see more stinky. I do like this wardrobe, though. Wow. Look at this. Look at this wardrobe right here. Look at the, look at the work. Look at the carving here. Oh, and that hardware. Oh, that hardware looks like two geese about to go. Mwah. See that? It's like. Mwah. It's like mwah. I'm so sorry with mad at you. I'm sorry mad at you. Okay, yeah. I'm, that's enough of me doing that. Um, cool. Oh, God, I want that sofa, too. Look at that. What is that, like a settee? I backed Victorian leather chair. I mean, damn. It's always wild in games like this because, like, in the modern times, it's hard to find anything, like, handmade that's not crazy expensive because we get, like, Ikea furniture that's like printed and packs flat. You got to put together yourself. But like everything in this game is like, ah, oh, we're poor and we get by. And then you look at it and you're like, that is a red leather chair. That is, are, are you insane? That's wild. The dark academia vibes are immaculate here. Katie, lady, it's all I want in my life. <gasps> Ryan is here and they're pissed. Is this game a must buy? I would say so, Tweeter Gibson. I mean, look, first time chat, Tweeter Gibson. Welcome on in. Um... Everybody's tastes are different. I know nothing about you. I don't know what kind of game you like. When this came out in early access, I did not like it. It was not for me, and now I'm obsessed. It also won game of the year. People pretty universally seem to enjoy it. Not everybody will, but... So, any who's All right, let's see here. No uh. arguing. Just tell me you're well. I... I'm well. Admit? We're working on it. You'll get him back. 
I owe him a kicking for showing Fig how to throw hatchets. So, this cult, what's our plan? I'm not fool enough to think I can change your mind. But if you're staying, I don't want you taking up arms. There are other ways to fight. Really? Like what? There are refugees outside the walls. They'll need protection. Healers, this place could serve as a hospital. Ignore Jahira. If it comes to it, pick up a sword. Rare. Um, I'm going to say they protect the refugees because they keep getting the raw end of the deal and we're trying to help them. You shame me. In all our hunting, I had put them from my mind. Oh, right. wow. Leave them to us then. If we can't get them past the checkpoints, we'll at least make sure they're watched over if it comes to fighting in the streets. If I have to stay home and babysit, then it's your job to make sure there's still a home to look after. Mm. Take what you need, and we'll do the grand reunion when you come back for good. <laughs> I love how we always do that in reverse, where like our pockets are bulging with all the stuff so, we just took from them, and they're like, you know what, you can have what you want. We're back, like, mother. Oh. Go away. You have I guess I'll go do. inside again and get member. that. Wait, one more thing. There are doppelgangers on our trail. One even went so far as to steal my face. Huh. All right, then. What was that face? If you turn up looking for hugs and kisses, I'll be sure to shoot first. That's my girl. Oh, they don't have a very healthy relationship, but they do love each other, and that's neat, too. Anything last to say to us, kiddo? Commander! Spare me your son. Oh, it's not Mole. Woman. Shoot. You let us slip right past you. Did not, Commander. Smell you coming. Your friend, too. Druidy smell. <laughs> Such keen senses. Druidy. I suppose you're up to keep going. I wonder if this is based off of how way. you started the game. Can we I were a druid a back in the day. No. Hmm. Fine. What does a druid smell like? Probably earthy, I'd say, Legala Spoon. I also, some of the druids, I imagine probably a little stinky. Um, all right, so I don't think we need Jahira anymore now. It was just about having those, excuse me, those moments. Send to come. Uh, I'm going to have her unequip these. Uh, I'm going to have her send these to Karlak. Karlak would love to wear these. Karlak would love to wear that. Karlak would love to have that. Patchouli. You know, Mr. Gillis, get in. It sucks, but I, I just, I hate the smell of patchouli. I hate it so much. Wish I didn't, because it's in like every incense in the world. But I do. Uh, oops, come on. Musty. Yeah, I could, I could see musty. I could see musty being the answer. My druid smells like hemlock, and that's canon. Ooh. Is this a vanilla playthrough or with mods? This is a vanilla playthrough, Gasp Judas. And because I didn't want to ruin my life with how busy I am, um, I'm only playing on stream, so this is still my first run. Um, because I was like, I have so much to do. If I add this to my free time, I'm just, I already barely sleep. I will just stop fully. Yes. Um, we need to part ways for a moment. See you back here. You're sure? <laughs> yeah. I Later think I'm going to be fine having car like I tell here. you not to get in trouble, but I suspect it will find you whether you like it or not. <laughs> oh, Jahira, we met you so late in the game, and I don't have the same connection with you that I have with the other characters, but that, you're, you're great. You're great. Um, all right. Uh, we've hey, got... you. Hey. Hey. So, what do you think of your hero, Jahira's house? I don't know what I was expecting. Something beyond real. My life would have been so different if I ended up working for her instead of Gortash. Looking after these kids. Mm, yeah, that would have been a better a difference. life. Maybe in the next life. Ed, come on. Right Fuck here. yes. Um, what's your favorite incense? Um, there are some that I have that are like, they're like kind of apple and autumn smelling. So I like I like autumn spice kind of scents, and I also have a uh, rose incense. I love rose. That being said, I don't really burn incense anymore. Um, my cat Zelda has asthma, and unless I'm really like plugging up the door with towels as though I were a college student, um, I just don't do it. Yeah, I just don't do it. 
Um, I guess I also don't need to... We don't need to rest. We didn't really use any skills or spells. So let's just get out. Get out of here. Leave and come. So December fall is dropping. Six, six, six. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Thank you very much, December fall. Saying my birthday is Saturday. Happy early birthday. Ooh, celebrate you. Um, and I know there are several other birth birthdays this week in chat. Could you please wish a happy birthday in the Astarian voice? Pretty please. So happy to found this wonderful community you have created. I don't think I can do a great Astarian voice, but I'll try. I'll be like, hold on. Wait a minute. Hold on. I have to get away from that noise. There. Let me, let me, let me, let me see him first. There we are. More like in here. Let, let's see what he's saying. Hello, my dear. Hello, my dear. I want to wish you the happiest of birthdays and know that you're loved and here for a reason, even if that reason is only you choose to be. Oh. I think happy birthday, everybody. <laughs> I think that works. I think that worked. <laughs> Oh, this is our Twitch bro. Oh, they love they love that we're doing this stream right now. This is our Twitch bro. I'm sorry. I don't think I can help you. I'm not fit for service. Move. You're not the bro I thought. You're not the twitchy bro that I thought you were. Ooh, a crowd. Oh, but it's all refugees. God, I want to help them eat. Um, oh, this is where we literally just were. I was like, oh, cool new spot. Um, iron fence. <laughs> well, I'm probably gonna enter that and steal. Oh, I can go around. Yeah, that's a door I'd steal from. There's a book. <gasps> forbidden book. Let's go. Mmm, forbidden book. Um, I am very curious what this location would ever be. But that is a that looks like a guard let's talk let's talk to them first let them know we're here before we do crime that's always good dragon's blood is one of my personal faves i used to burn uh the dragon's blood incense. i like that a lot i think i associate that with like my first ever like bachelor pad in la because that's what i burned okay i thought that was a person on the ground i'm like god are dead people just on the street and it's fine here um december fall happy flipping early birthday and i hope you have a wonderful year um, Madame Satsi dropping 10 flipping bucks. Thank you so much. There's no message attached, so I will just say thank you very much. I appreciate you. Um, very nice of you. Oh, speaking of dragons. Oh, look at this sharp dresser. Tarun, uh, Nemanis. <sighs> I don't want anyone to panic, but the doctor says it's Tarun Nemanis. Um, it's good that we found it now. Um, but basically my bones are going to turn into little dragons. All right, uh, Madame Satsi, thank you again very much. A good day to you, sir. I apologize, but Lady Janeth is not currently welcoming visitors. Then we will have to visit unwelcomely. If you are here with regards to her recent marriage, you may leave any gifts or warm wishes with me, and I will ensure she receives them. <clears throat> Forgive me. Oh, they're As doing like mommy hear, and daddy wrestling? Lady Janeth is indisposed at present. Please come back another time. Quick save. Um, all right, uh, let's see. And you are, your discretion is admirable. Now tell me what's going on here. Indisposed, sounds like she's being murdered. Who did Lady Janeth marry? Sounds like you're a very happy couple. Uh, also, trade. Dismissal of staff. Yeah, I'll buy your secrets off of you. Pot. Oh, lid. Second, I thought you were going to jail. Um, yeah, I'll buy that. But also, I'm pretty sure you told me you wanted. Didn't you want two potion bottles? Isn't that right? Didn't I know about that? Can you say about that? Didn't you want a big one? Oh, that was that kid's book, huh? We did just take that kid. Ugh. Well, so it goes. Um, didn't you, didn't you want to buy? Hmm. Right. Um. Indisposed. I thought she was being murdered. 
I assure you, absolutely nothing untoward is happening in Just a little bit of... Uh... Lady Janet wishes for some time alone with her new spouse and has sent her staff on holiday accordingly. Does she often send her entire staff away at such short notice? Ordinarily, no. Though such generosity would not be out of character. But in this instance, I fear she has other motivations. Motivations I will not talk about. Yeah, you will. <laughs> because I'm a bard. Um, funny way to spend your holidays stood right outside your workplace. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna make it obvious and I'm like, hey, it's a little weird that you're just like here, you know? In ordinary circumstances, I'd appreciate her generosity more fully, but, well, you said I when to be here for when she when you said when life. why when fair enough. I'll leave them. To They're yes. just doing a jigsaw. Quite right. I just bought a jigsaw Jonesy and I'm so excited. I'm not going to have time this weekend. Sorry, you're talking about a jigsaw puzzle. I mean, I bought the actual tool, a jigsaw, and I am very excited. Very excited. I just realized the Dragon Board's eyes are fiery. I did also realize that in that moment. I feel like this guy knows that something's up, and he was like, I really want to make sure. What are you going to make with the saw? Asks uh, Nomninsk. Nomninsa. Um... I have some ideas. I have some ideas. Um, one thing that I have trouble with is, um, like many cat owners, um, I have what you like to generally call stinky babies. Um, and so, um, do you do jigs while you saw with it? Little dance for cutting stuff up? Well, obviously this is a trapped chest and we're screwed, but why not? Let's give it a shot. Um, uh, so I'm going to, uh, there's no good place in my living space for a litter box. It doesn't fit in the bathroom, which is where you might want to do it. There's no closet where it makes sense. There's just, it's it's going to be out and about somewhere. So did your coffin cat tree come in yet? It did. I just haven't had a chance to build it. Um, I've had it for like a minute now. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to find like a classic. It's a hard line to walk because I want to find a classic like chest, like an antique like steamer trunk. Um, like how people used to travel on trains, like, oh yes, just put my luggage up there, and it's a big ass, like, chest. Um, and I need to find one that, is, A, matches my stuff, B, is old enough to be cool that it's there and a part of the decor, but not so vintage and cool and in good shape that it's like, oh my god, I can't believe you're gonna cut into this, right? Like, it's a hard balance to find. And I have one that I could use, it's, it's a little bit too big, but I'm probably going to, you know, do some estate sales or something. I do love estate sales. Um, I'll find one and, and basically cut like a cat uh, litter box hole, size hole in the side for them to conveniently go in and out. And then I'll still be able to put things on top like a plant, a cat safe plant, obviously, but or, you know, some kind of lamp or something that just makes it more of like a thing as opposed to there is your litter box and then when i need to clean it you can just, just open it up properly and uh i can't wait to do that um very excited very excited so um oh i didn't tell you all my cool um estate sale story the other day um so That's i went to an estate sale on saturday very very briefly i just like That's i needed to do it. something for i was like burning out a little bit again and i needed to do something for just me um so I was like, I'm just going to go to an estate sale for a minute. And estate sales, for anybody who doesn't know, is when someone passes away and uh, all of their goods aren't going to a particular person, like maybe their family doesn't want anything else, they hold an estate sale to recoup some of the losses, where it's like, come in, you know, get things for a good deal, you know, one man's trash is another man's treasure kind of vibes. Um, and so uh, that is what I did. So I always make sure to be very, very respectful, obviously. You know, you're not going to be like, oh, cool, bargains. It's like, I'm going to go look at the stuff and see if anything jumps out at me. Um, and usually you can haggle a little bit, but you also know it's like a bereaved family, so you got to be careful. And so it's hard in Los Angeles because it's so hit and miss because, like, when they list things online, they don't usually tell you, like, prices. So you have to look at it and be like, am I going to be able to get, like, a thing for, like, 20 bucks or, like, 
I've seen ones before where they're like, we can't say the name, but this was a famous person who worked for this studio who passed. Here there is their table. I'm like, that's gorgeous. That's going to be thousands of bucks. I'm not even, I shouldn't even be walking in that building. Anyway, I go into this one and I explore for a while. It's really cool. And I start putting together that this was like an old Jewish woman. Um, she was a pharmacist. I could tell just from all of her stuff. Um, lots of like, you can tell lots of history there, lots of stories. And so there was a mirror that I saw that I ended up buying, um, that I like a lot, still haven't put up and I got a really good price on it. Um, it was the last day. So they're basically just like, take whatever, like you gotta, it's gotta be gone. Um, and so, yeah. Um, so it was the one that I'd seen online and I got that. And as I was leaving, a lady goes, oh, I, she said, I love that mirror, but not like, oh, I love that mirror. Good find. It was like, oh, I love that mirror. And I was like, ooh. And I said it down. I was like, yeah, it is gorgeous, huh? Did you know the deceased? And she was like, uh, yeah, yeah, we were neighbors. And I was like, if you don't mind, can I ask at least, at least like, first name? Like, who, who was she? And she's like, oh, well, her name was such and such. And I'm not trying to, like, blow up someone's spot for their family or whatever. You know, so apparently she was 104 years old. She was a Holocaust survivor. She uh, spent a lot of time in her community making it what it is and like building up a specific spot in LA to be more of like a spot. Um, it was very sweet, friends with her neighbors, was a pharmacist. Um, I was like, wow, 104, you know. So apparently she was very ready, like, what am I still doing here? Like, what am I still doing? But, you know, she sounded great. And it was just cool to be like, okay, like, yeah, I've got that mirror and like, that's a cool mirror, but now I get to like put a name to it. And I just, I love stuff like that. And I got to like talk to a nice lady and pet her dog. And like, you know, it's just nice to meet people. I like went to an estate stuff one time and just, you know, you just, just anyway, you find yourself in the, in the coolest conversation, meeting people you'd have never otherwise met. So any hoozle, that's just what I wanted to share the other day when I was like, oh, I want to make a TikTok about it, but also like, it's, it's more sentimental than just me doing like a kind of filter, you know, on, on TikTok. So mm, I feel like there'd be some sneaky hiding stuff over here. Nothing interesting buried here. No use digging here. Um, but yeah, that's it. So thanks for listening. Also love an antique mirror. Yeah, I wouldn't say it's like an antique antique. But it's definitely on the older side. It's um, it looks like real wood, but it's pretty clearly made of uh plaster. Ooh, poltergeist lost condition invisible. Okay, so there's poltergeist here. We know that now. Thanks for telling me. Text of game. <laughs> um, but yeah, there, there for sure poltergeist. Um, but yeah, it, it's it's plaster, but it's still older and very heavy. So ornate. I mean, I guess yeah, it's definitely ornate. You wouldn't find something like it these days. Um, we, uh, we got Iridescence TW dropping five flipping bucks. Thank you very much, Iridescent. And Iridescent said, and I quote, um, I sleep during the day, so catching your streams is rare for me, but I'm always so excited when I can. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you. Uh, just want you to know that I love your content and I'm very proud of you and how far you've come. That's so sweet. Thank you. I'm glad you could catch me. Um, I do have VODs, you know, um, but I know that it's probably different watching live. Um, but I really appreciate you. In my opinion, this is the most frustrating location of the game. Interesting. Well, I guess I'll find out why. Probably a billion battles with spooky old invisible ghosts. Anyway. Um, this comedy of errors, button butler. Okay, cool. Um, I'm gonna go in here and I'm just gonna say, let go, let God. Janet's estate. Man, we keep um there we go. Now we got some perception going on. Good job. Thank you, Carlac. In fact, hold on, there were insight checks from before. Once per long rest to critical, uh pearlescent restoration. What is this one? You can replenish expended spell slots of your choice. Isn't there a, okay, that's, I mean, that's pretty good. Shatter is fine. Um, amulet of all on a hit, inflict bleeding upon targets that has maximum hit points. That's pretty good, but at the same time, I've realized with Karlak, like we kind of just, we kind of burn down enemies really quickly, you know? We, we really do. Like they don't stay alive long enough for things like bleeding to like matter, you know? Um. But I, I would want her to, what's the one where like we get restoration? There was the one that was like, oh, you get advantage on all these different checks. Gain advantage on intelligence, wisdom, and charisma saving throws. Okay, that's not what I'm looking for then. Never mind. It's so good. Oh, my God. So good. 
All right, well, let's see what this spooky old place has in store for us. Contractor's record. And actually, I do have to end stream pretty soon here. Um, sliding door. Ooh, okay. Sliding door concealed to cubby in atelier or atelier. I've never known how to say that word. Um, additional cost for structural reinforcements after door installation, making it more secret. For okay, so there's a sliding door to a cubby in atelier. Now I just have to find out what an atelier is and we're good to go. Your new, your new ring. Our Lady Janet, our most profound and gracious thanks for your patronage and granting us the honor of crafting your wedding ring. We wish you the greatest joy for your upcoming nuptials, and should you desire in years to mark the happy occasion with a similar gift and craft the quality, uh, yours, Omatola. Um, we just had another noticing sound. What did I notice? It just, it sucks that they don't like really see it that well. Um, you know, we're going to lead with a star in here because we're going to help him be a sneaky boy. Wee. Um, wooden desk. Regards, missing painter. Okay, so this is a murder. This is going to be based off a murder house, right? This is H.H. H. Holmes. I appreciate the offer of a generous donation to Fist Coffers. I've got neither the authority or spare boots on the ground to authorize a sword post wide search for your friend, Mr. Feverus. I'll keep an eye out while I'm on the beat in the city, but until we get the full steel watch rollout promised by the benevolent Lord Gortash, we're simply stretched too thin. I hope he shows up soon, my lady. I, I really do. All the best. The Vela Fountainhead. Did the voice wrong? Great. Um, rows of books. The approachables. Yeah, devil in me is typing, right? I'm like, this, this, this is for sure another murder house. 100%. The gate is closed. Baldur's Gate, a bastion of commerce and culture, rewarded only with corruption and catastrophe, crime, poverty. Enough, enough. The gate is closed. Okay, ooh. We got a got an Angie Noble of some kind. Uh, target is blocked. Where can we move this? Wait, can we move it? Can we move? We sure can't. We sure can't. Not enough space. Target is blocked. Not enough space. Nope. Okay, well, then never mind. All right, then I think... Oh, wait. That's what probably we noticed. With pleasure. Plus 13. Yeah, they weren't even trying. Great. A fancy crossbow that's not better than what we already have, but these special arrows are kind of awesome. What? Does this mean it's a trivia murder party? Oh, yeah. I forgot. You guys are still here, huh? Well, answer me this. In 1975, pumpkins were made illegal in what U.S. state? Oh, God, I don't know this one at all. This must have been a total guess. Um, all right, uh, let's see here. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and read out uh, Mia's Lotus because Mia's Lotus dropped 50 flipping bucks. Let's go, Mia's Lotus. Thank you so much. That is bonkers generous. Uh, please drop some generous mother geese in chat. <laughs> Thank you. Um, saying hi, Damien. I'm an anxious little guy today, so I'm happy you were able to stream. I'm visiting family tomorrow. Mm. I can see why that would maybe be a little bit anxiety inducing. Um, I'm curious if it's from now until Christmas holiday season times, because that's a long time. Um, I very much wish you well and hope you can find some time to decompress. Go to the bathroom if you have to and just be like, yeah, I'm pooping for an hour. Like, I know it's not easy, but I wish you well. Um, uh, anyway, I ordered one of the autographed pictures of Kudo from you, and I'm so excited to get it. Sending much love to you, Damien. Thank you very much, Mia's Lotus. I appreciate you. That's a great point. Um, Mia's Lotus, uh, first of all, again, thank you. That's very generous. And tell you what, visiting family is different for everybody. So just find those times to take your space. You are allowed to take your space. It is okay. Um, uh, so yes, uh, on Sunday, this coming Sunday, I will be doing... Uh, Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Right here on this streaming channel, I will be doing a signing with Miranda Parkin. Um, Miranda and I voice the two uh, main characters in My Happy Marriage, the Netflix ma uh, anime. Um, very excited for that, uh, and we'll have a grand old time. And I still plan on doing a normal stream too on Sunday. So either I start stream and then switch over to that for like an hour or whatever, and then come back to stream, or um, maybe I do that first and then continue on stream from there. I don't know. Um, but yeah, that'll be that'll be a lot of fun. And unfortunately, I think now realizing what time it is, I think I got to get skedoodling. 
think I gotta get skadoodling and we'll keep spooky old murder house um for next time are you streaming tomorrow or is the next one Sunday I'm almost certainly not streaming tomorrow ordinarily I would be streaming tomorrow for anyone who's new here um but I am uh I'm I'm putting a better foot forward for voiceover next year um so I'm actually taking a uh a a class a workshop tomorrow with the casting director um and so i'm very excited for that but that's gonna run until like eight and it's gonna it goes all through like dinner hours so my assumption is like okay i'm gonna finish at eight then i'm gonna need food and i'll be right in that weird time of like oh it's 8 30 like yeah it's a little late to stream but maybe i could so i'm probably not gonna stream um friday night i have plans saturday i have plans so sunday it is <laughs> um God, I thought I'd be streaming so much more in December, and yet December ended up being the busiest month of them all. Let me say, let me quit the game real quick. We're gonna swap back to me. Uh, for anyone who's new here, thank you so much for hanging out for the first time. I appreciate you. I'm of course going to read out all the resubscribers before I go. Any new subscribers, uh, you of course now have access to the Discord, so I hope we get to see you there. We're gonna be doing some cool stuff to incentivize that for the next year. Um, you are just on it, Wayward Jaybird. Thank you for doing that. Good luck catching the elusive unicorn called sleep. You know what? I've been getting better sleep lately, which is nice. Um, last week was a little rough, but this, the past like several days, I've been like, okay, I'm feeling pretty good. So yeah, um, let's see here. Um, thank you so much for joining. Anybody who tipped, dropped sub bombs, new subscribers, and then also just joining in, hanging out, whether you chatted or not. Thank you so much. Damien said better work-life balance. I think not. Well, yes, but I'd, I'd argue just different work-life balance um i've shifted some stuff so that i'm actually still able to sleep which is nice um but no you know i'm still figuring it out but i do i do honestly believe that um uh 2024 is going to be a lot easier in terms of balance and i'm going to just have to make you know new norms and stuff like i said i'm going to put some more emphasis on streaming and make it less of like a oh this is my sad thing and be like no i this is i i'm going to plan things out and stick to them you know what i mean um so yeah, um, but let us give a warm and spicy welcome back and thank you to all the resubscribers who keep on supporting month after month. Your support definitely has changed my life and means the world to me. So thank you so much to Carly W for their three year cleverversary. Golden nobles descend from on high to bring you cake in the chat. Um, Carly W, thank you so flippin' much for the support. Three years is a heck of a long time. Let's go uh i don't know ten thousand more um and also a big old thank you to noah cola tiana gacp rosa elena and amandy m davis for all helping me carry those blue cakes they're very heavy they're made of tungsten um thank you so much carly w and i greatly appreciate your support um moo and cat for their eighth month uh, ass off harry styles for their 11th because i am batman for their three year cleverversary let's go <gasps> Goldie moogles descend from an high degree um thank you so very much because i am batman i'm batman um i appreciate that a lot three years again is wild um i'm so glad you are not bored of me quite yet or if you are bored that you still subscribe <laughs> so thank you very much um hannah may for their 40th month shibuki alarm pants for their 14th gifted by rosa elena thank you very much for that baby legs for their fourth we got a storybook ending for their 13th thank you very much storybook ending wonderland's andy for their sixth we got liz drown and caffeine for their 49th king bacchus for their 37th demo nacho for their 29th blanquita for their fourth rosa elena for their 14th at a tier three let's go thank you for that extra big old chunk of support um tier three is wild especially because i have given no incentive for doing that so thank you for doing that um in the new year i'd like to but still thank you andrea m for their 33rd justice blue for their second servo for their 10th we got ventus j for their sixth king hunter for their second kerosene entertainment for their ninth skylar babes for their eighth robo at a tier two for their 33rd thank you very much robo i appreciate you oodle for much danger bacon for their 40th la mama de gatos for their 11th we got incredible hulk for their second Dis Disgraced Grace for their 29th. Wayward Jaybird for their 39th. And speaking of Wayward Jaybird, let's give a shout out to all the mods. Thank you for uh, always hanging out and making this place such a big part of what it is. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you. Wayward Jaybird, I know you were here tonight. I, oh, shout out to all the mods tonight. Shout out to all the mods in general. Um, the Deer King for their fourth. T Breezy for their 46th. Amethyst Amy for their fifth. Uh, Bean her. Oh, got it. <laughs> Pest free since. O three for their seventh. Thank you very much. Andrew J. Noe for their 41st. 
Andy for their third. We got Puffy Ducks for their third. C Zizzle for their 11th. We've got um, Love Life for You for their 49th. Uh, Kitty Killjoy for their second. Neferia for their 35th. Nick Meyer for their second. Thank you very much, Jenna, for gifting to Nick. Um, we got Lemony Drew for their fifth. Arachnus Web for their 34th. Gifted by Desi Lou. Thank you very much, Desi Lou. Again, Desi Lou, thank you very much for the gift to the P.O. Box. Um, I know I say I don't shout out specific ones, but it was asked. It was like, does it make, I gotta make sure that things are delivered. I, I know I certainly got one. So thank you very much. Um, Dark Princess for their ninth. Iced Kofefe for their ninth. Particular List for their fifth. Glitter Puke for their 49th. And then Library Beetle for their two year Cleverversary. Oh, you get blue cakes, Library Beetle. Thank you so much. I hope it's not the kind of beetle that like eats pages because some some do some do and that's real spooky um thank you for two years of support i greatly appreciate that and i appreciate you and here's the ten thousand more and it looks like i actually got one more uh tip rolling in that i'm gonna read out here before we call it an eve um let's see here oh oh we got quincy's tavern streaming let's uh let's raid oh actually i don't think we've ever raided breezy brizzy voices is streaming tonight too we could raid brizzy voices um Anyway, we'll do a stream after this, so stick around even just for a minute so we can send a, a nice little hello over to people. Um, Glitter Puke dropping $4.20. Nice. Uh, thank you very much. Saying, what do you call a group of bards all wearing plate armor? A heavy metal band. Clever. Anyway, I hope you and the Clever Cooper are having a great day today. Got a question, Wishfish. Would you be willing to read a poem for us as the Burger Man? Well, I suppose since the Burger Man is something I did on Smosh, that's an official Smosh property right there. I don't have the rights to read that on stream. I could read it as a very deep voiced fast food related character. Maybe. I'm just messing with you. Probably, sure. I don't know. Maybe. Um, but thank you very much, Glitter Puke. I, the Beef Boy. See, there we go. Beef Boy. Onion. I'm pretty positive I've called someone a Beef Boy on stream before, too. So, Annabelle Lee by Edgar Allan Poe. You know what? Not one of the Poe ones that I talk about as much, but Annabelle Lee, Annabelle Lee is not a, not a bad idea. Um, all right, y'all. Thank you so much for joining. Let me see. Let me make sure. I, I always get burned when I do this. Let me really quickly make sure that uh, Brizzy is actually streaming currently actively so I don't screw this thing up. I always send my stream over to people who are like not streaming anymore. They're like, well, that was a good time to stream, everybody. Bye forever. Um, all right, I'm going to space. Uh, all right, let's see here. These aren't okay, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Brizzy is streaming. So let's uh, go ahead and send a raid on over. Even if you got to run, it's always nice to just pop over for a raid for even like 30 seconds just to be nice and say hi and send a big old group to them. So let's just, uh, let's do, uh, we're going to do a uh, voice actors unite raid. Uh, I'm going to say actually voice actors assemble raid. Um, oh wait, no, no, no. Actually, hold on. Pigeons are voice actors to raid. That's what we'll yell. Boom, boom. Okay, so we're gonna copy and paste this here. If you guys don't know Brizzy Voices, you've probably seen uh, TikToks and such. Uh, another voice actor, very talented. And let's go send some love over to Brizzy Voices. Boom. All right, my dear Clever Coop. I look forward to Sunday. I'm, I'm remiss to be missing you until then. So Clever Coop, as I always say, whether you tip, you subscribe, you throw bits my way, or you just support me by watching with your eyeballs, I so, so, so appreciate you. I love this community, and I could not and would not want to do this without you. Um, thanks so much for hanging out tonight. Y'all are wonderful and lovely. Thanks for hanging out on a Wednesday, which I wouldn't normally do. And until next time, Clever Coop, you are dismissed. Now let's go raid. Bye, everybody. See you soon. Bye, 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 bye.